Bungle Dungle speaking. How may we add to your chaos today? Welcome to Pokemon Dusk Episode 1. Last episodes we did, well, last two episodes where, you know, you know how the channel works at this point. So if we screw something up, we'll still post it anyways because it's fun. Why not? But, um, yep. <coughs> we're going to play on normal mode this time because it has the opportunity. Okay, there's like three, four endings in this game. You play the hardcore mode, you're guaranteed to get the true ending. But this yep. mode... Um, you could still unlock the true ending and some other endings. So, by all means, we're gonna start a new game. Yep. On normal. Because hardcore mode kicked our ass. Yeah. <laughs> and the fact that we have Nurse Joy along with the, for the ride is perfectly fine. And I'm gonna be doing a really stupid voice for Ethan. It's gonna be <laughs> kind of like Ash catch him, but it's because it's gonna suck. No, it's cute. Shut the fuck up. <laughs> Shut the hell up. <laughs> Why is the game not appearing again? What? Oh, I I looked away from the window. <sighs> Scared me. I thought that would have to be the fifth time recording. Yeah, we did like three again. other recordings, and the OBS was just like, no, uh. <laughs> yep. Like both times, basically. So March 25th, yeah. 2000. Right? God. Tell me about it. <clears throat> the, the typical bung bung experience. You know how it is. You're gonna love. <laughs> Y'all know how it is. <laughs> you're gonna love this stupid voice I got for Ethan. <clears throat> oh no. Scared. Finally, we're out of Elex Forest. Look, Brando, we're almost in Goldenrod City. We actually got here before dark. Isn't that great? It's like a Messed up Ash Ketchum. No, it's cute. Shut the fuck up. Oh. <laughs> Come on, Brando. Let's find you a Pokemon Center for you. We should avoid the tall grass. We love it. I thought, like, you know what? I never checked. That's why we're going to a Pokemon Center. Interesting. Oh. I never really bothered to check that. Yeah, we never did. <laughs> we never really checked, like, why. So, yeah. <coughs> Ethan's pretty cool. He's already got two gym badges. Yeah. He's making his way downtown, walking fast. Faces Face past down. as we're homebound. <laughs> Let's not save yet. Let's just keep going. Do, do, well, do, do, do. well, we get unlimited <coughs> saves, I think, because they yeah. didn't mention anything about, like, oh, you can only save, like, one time. Yeah, but there's nothing here, happening right it. now, so. Yeah, Ando's my only Pokemon. I can't give him to the daycare. He's my only protection. I'm happy that normal mode doesn't just limit you on like hardcore mode. It's like, uh -uh, you're not allowed to save. Right? <laughs> God. Um, what? The Pokemon Center's closed. How is oh. that possible? That's never happened to me. Well, maybe he's EP, okay? Hmm. I think we should ask a citizen about what's going on here. I'm pretty sure the people could help us. What about the Pokemon? Ethan's like, how dare you be Eevee? I need help. Locked. That's <laughs> strange. Oh. Ah. Excuse me, ma'am. No. -uh. Uh, hello? Ma'am? Can you hear me? No. -uh. <laughs> oh, shit. Oh, oh my god, what happened to you? Are you feeling alright? Do I look alright? <laughs> <laughs> yeah. You're bleeding! Look, let me help you! Can you tell me what's up with the Pokemon Center? Strangely, it's clo- I love how he's like, Holy shit, you're bleeding! Let me help you! By the way, why is the Pokemon Center closed? <laughs> Dumbass kid. I was about to say. It's fine, he's only 10. <laughs> <laughs> That's like really funny though. Another dead walking body. Take that! Oh god. Oh fuck! That was my last bullet. Oh my god! Why did you shoot this poor woman? Murderer! If I had shot this lady, you'd both be dead meat now, boy. What? What? Uh. Ethan. All the stress. Yeah. This is the old lady, I think. The boy probably had a shock and lost his consciousness. He'll certainly wake up soon. Check if he was bitten. If he was, we'll end his life quickly. He is completely fine. No need to be worried. Oh, yeah, you you had her voice like... I, I'm assuming that's Nurse Joy. Oh, okay. I thought you were that's doing the I'm old lady like... voice. Nah. I'm... <laughs> Cause Nurse Joy's the nurse, the doctor, so like she need to probably know more but than the old lady. Even though her like thing is treating Pokemon, but shut up. 
that's fine. But yeah, that's. Uh, I'm just imagining like maybe it's Nurse Joy who's going to just like <laughs> checking on Ethan. Yeah. Oh, it is old. Oh, god damn it. Whatever. <laughs> Ow, you're finally awake. How are you doing, young boy? Also, fuck you, game for proving me wrong. I was thinking Nurse Joy was uh, all smart about it, but no. He's old lady. You're cute. It's okay. Fucking <laughs> oh, <laughs> Where am I? Who are you? Don't worry, sweetie. You're safe now. My name is Martha. Save Martha! I'm sorry, like, I had to I do the Batman vs. Superman joke again. Couldn't help it. Martha, no! God. You were in the underground of Goldenrod City. Wait, what were you gonna say for a second there? You were gonna say something, but I sidetracked you. I forgot. Shit! <laughs> you had a shock and Dave brought you here. Dave? Oh, that's what I was gonna be. I was like, this is like probably the world's shittiest like old lady voice ever. I was honestly, I like, I like the old lady voice. It's, it sounds, more, it sounds gentle. It's cute. Really? Okay. Yeah. If you say so. I'm the like guy that. who saved your ass out there. Here's my last bullet for you. I like giving Dave the like stereotypical American voice for some reason. I don't know why. You know that. I, 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 I remember you shot this woman. Wait a moment. Randall, how's my Quilava doing? I don't really say it's because of the sprite, but like then again, it's like yeah. a bit, so I like, can't really tell. <laughs> I like how Discord didn't even pick up what you were doing there. Wait, what? It didn't even pick up your Quilava. Oh. Of course not. Of course. Let me try it again. Lava, lava, there you lava. go. Fuck you, Discord. <laughs> Piece of shit. <laughs> oh, you're all right. That's great. <laughs> Sorry, it's the way it walks. She walks. It's funny. I know, right? Hello, I took care of your koala while you were asleep. His wounds are all healed and he is totally fit again. How are you, my boy? Do you think you can stand up already? I... I think I can. Could you tell me now where exactly I am? I know that no. this is somewhere in the underground of the city, but what is this? And why did Dave murder that woman? She was already injured. This is the emergency bunker in the underground of Goldenrod City. We have everything we need. Beds, food, medical treatment. We are safe here for now. Safe? F from what? What are you talking about? That woman I shot in front of your eyes? She wasn't human anymore. Cause she was already dead. D dead? But she was still moving towards me. That's the point. Is, it, is there a beeping? Or am I going nuts? I heard beep. Oh, uh, maybe my neighbors because they're doing construction outside. Oh, no, it's my phone notification. I changed it. To oh, what? It goes <laughs> beep beep. No, yes. <laughs> Whatever. That's the point. <laughs> okay. They are neither really dead or really alive. They? Yes. They. Living dead. Well, you know, zombies, them zombies or whatever. Roamers, lame brains. <laughs> Infected, zombies, whatever. <laughs> Lame brains. <laughs> I love that. <laughs> uh. They're everywhere now, and they crave for one thing: living meat. A woman from before. She wanted to eat you and your quail alive. I screwed up the accent real bad there. Oh my! Mm. I got to get real in and out American boys. There we go. <laughs> God. What are you saying? Th this can't be. That's how it is. She had bitten you just once, you'd become one of them within a few hours. W what do you mean? Once you get bitten by an undead, you start to feel sick. Your body temperature rises until the fever kills you eventually. Problem God. is, you won't stay dead for long. You'll return as a mindless undead creature. This... This has to be a bad dream, right? Tell me I'm dreaming. I would be great, boy. A, a cure, or a vaccine, or I'm sure there has to be one, right? Oh, unfortunately not. We aren't even sure what caused this horrendous mutation. The only thing we can do now is survive. Can't do anything besides that. I, I swear I'm not trying to play it up. This is the only way I can keep the accent without faltering it. I'm dead, I'm dead serious. It's okay, it's cute. <laughs> But what if we just flee from the city? No way. These roamers have taken over the entire city. And the areas outside the city are even worse. If 
unfortunately, everyone with a flying attack Pokemon already fled from the city. And they left us behind. Egoistic bastards. Even the gym leader Whitney disappeared without a trace. But Brando and I just left the Elex Forest. We didn't see any undead. What? That's impossible! The Elex Forest is filled with those beasts! You getting out of there was pure luck. Going there would be suicide. We stay here. Fortunately, we found this emergency bunker that was built a long time ago. But there's still a lot to do. If you want to stay, you gotta prove your worth to the group. Come to me! Ugh, excuse me, indigestion. <laughs> Once you're prepared to take on your first task. <laughs> I like the idea. I love the idea that Dave just has fucking indigestion mid sentence yeah. like that. He's just. <laughs> I'm sorry about that. God. <laughs> well, let's talk to everybody in here. Dave, that's nice for you. Talk to him. No! Just trash. <laughs> Hello, Ethan. If you're going to love us weekend, you can come to me and I'll heal it. But our medical supplies aren't as sumptuous as in the Pokemon Center. Which means that I can. Oh, shit. Which means that I can heal you for a love fight just five times. But we can save as much as we want. Therefore. Yeah. Null and void. We can die and just load back where we died. Yeah. Come back if you need any help. I like that also it's two more than the fucking hardcore mode games. Right? Normal stove. Well, at least we can eat warm food down here. Now, who needs to do the dishes? Not me! No! -uh. Watch Dave make him do dishes. <laughs> God. The survivor group stores food in here, which needs cooling. That's what a fridge does if you didn't know. <laughs> You made him look at the camera too while you said that. because yeah, yeah, it worked. God. A lot of medical stuff. <laughs> Only Nurse Joy had it, you know, so to use them. Yeah, I know a bandage is out of my fucking professionality, I, mean, I got gas. <laughs> That's a stupid ass 10 year old horror. A pile of old wood. I have no use for this. God. If I had the time, I could probably read a couple of books. That's. Uh. <laughs> my mom would kill me if she caught me with one of these. <laughs> Jeez. What is in there? What? Silly magazines. There's some oh. blankets and covers stored in this box. <laughs> oh, I get it. So if whoever was using those could change the sheets because oh, they're I'm fucking perverts. <laughs> okay, we're out of here. <laughs> Wait, we have one my more person to talk to. <laughs> God. Hi, my name is Billy. Your name must be Ethan, right? Why do I look so sad? Because fuck you. That's what I'm just kidding. <laughs> Imagine. Something depresses me. I don't want to talk about it. Not yet. <laughs> oh, whoops. Hi. She doesn't tell us yet, that's right. Oh! oh. <laughs> there we go. Almost broke the game. <laughs> Did I mention I really like the music? Me too. Could you imagine we accidentally used all of our saves if this was hardcore and I did that? Holy shit, that would have been hilarious. <laughs> right? Because you can't, you, you can't tell if you saved or not. Right? <laughs> it seems like Dave took a couple things from the empty houses and put them here. Some old metal pieces. I wonder if they could still be used for something. Like a spear. Take a broomstick and a knife, just tape it together and you're good. <laughs> Ethan having psychotic thoughts. Ten years old. Someone threw some tattered books in here. A fucking oh, plant. So what is that knife what? that they use in the, the Last of Us with the duct tape and then like shard of glass or whatever and then they just... <laughs> it's just a makeshift knife. It starts with an... No, it starts with an S. They had like a really fancy a name for it. I can't remember. Thank you. <laughs> hey, Ethan. What I dragged you in here, I noticed an infected Houndor following us. A uh, Houndor? The Pokemon? Yes. Humans as well as Pokemon can get infected. Anyways, I have neither pistol bow 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 <laughs> Forgive me, my old age is catching up to me. Neither pistol bullets nor a strong Pokemon to kill it. We're safe in here. But I don't have a good feeling with a zombie at the front of our door. Your quite lava seems strong enough to beat these monsters. We have to get rid of it. That shithead is over there! <laughs> yeah? Dave, I don't know if you should be calling a zombie a shit- FUCK YOU! They don't understand a thing, they're dumb! Oh my god! <laughs> okay, Dave. Whatever you say, I guess. Come on! Cool. 
Now this is where your Quailava comes into play. Forget everything you know and whatever you think you know about Pokemon battles. This is just about survival. Just, yep, yep. Mm -hmm. just shut the fuck I up. Need to Kiss you. my ass. Suck my dick. Yep. But I need to tell you how to push buttons, okay? You don't understand. You push down. There you go. When you see the letter A, <laughs> you push down on it, and that's how you push a button, okay? Don't worry about it. Okay, Brando. Imagine there's a tutorial about how to push a button in Pokemon. <laughs> Imagine. Okay, Brando. Like, <laughs> <laughs> like how we're both about to say something. We could. I love it. <laughs> bungle du normal bungle dungle experience. Attack! Yep. Okay. Sorry. That was okay. like my battle cry for Koalava. <laughs> eh, eh, I get wrecked, idiot. Eh, I can't even touch it. Can't touch it. Oh shit. Oh shit. Oh shit. <laughs> <laughs> that was. That worked was... great! Your Quilava has a lot of potential. Okay. Let's go back in. It's gonna start getting normal the more I do it. That's the fun part. Yeah. <laughs> that was excellent, Ethan. You are a great Pokemon trainer, but this is just the get the big day, the beginning. You're cute. Fast trip up of my speech one more time. I think I'm gonna drink myself into a coma. <laughs> God. <laughs> when I saved you, I was actually searching for someone. You mean? I was actually looking for Harold when I accidentally met you. Some bitch, wrong person. Anyways, couldn't just let you die out there, of course, so I dragged you down here. Tasked Harold with blocking the entrances to the city so that no more undead can come into the city. I said the city twice, but it's okay. But he still hasn't come back. God! You know that I don't have any ammunition. What do you mean by that? <laughs> I was clearing my throat. Sorry, Ethan. Well, you and Quilava are a strong team. Harold is yeah. responsible for our safety. If something went wrong, we're all in even greater danger than before. We need to know what happened, and that's why I'm asking you. Find him, please. F but outside, what if he's already dead? I want to stay here and survive. I know you're afraid, oh. but we'll all die if Harold didn't finish his task. And trust me, I excuse me, we've already lost some good people during yeah. the last couple of days. <laughs> Where's the hit tally for you? <laughs> I don't want to see anyone die anymore. Everyone here has to do their best. Nurse Joy takes care of the injured. Martha cares for them afterwards and is responsible for the rest. I analyze the city's weak points and search for secret passages. And Harold fixes these problematic spots. And you have a strong Pokemon at your side. We have no other Pokemon here, unfortunately. <clears throat> But we all have to work together if we want to survive. Mm. All right, I got it. <laughs> cool. Sorry. I'll bless you. I'll do it. We'll search for him. He probably would be dead if it wasn't for him. Hmm. <laughs> Thank you, Ethan. You should go back to Route 34 and take a look at the exit of Elex Forest. That's where he wanted to start securing the city. You could also take on side quests from other survivors. I think that girl, Melanie, might have an urgent problem. We'll no, I don't! <laughs> She's just Imagine. gone on the other side of the house. <laughs> go on. We'll, go, we'll look after her. Brando, let's go. Quilava, Quilava. Ethan, do you have a moment for me? I have to remember her voice for a second. You are doing all of us a great favor, so I want to give you this. Yes! Yay! A berry generates 5 HP if you're Pokemon. Okay. Just open your bag and use it. Thanks a lot. I'm sure we'll need this. Okay. No, Nose, can you frick off? <laughs> oh, we're fully healed. Okay, good. Save. <laughs> Hi, Ethan. When this disease broke out, we were hunted by a lot of infected. My brave bell sprout stayed behind, so I had a chance <clears throat> to escape. But it got attacked and bitten in the head. And now I know. I thought my cute little Bellsport was one of them. I'm <laughs> sorry, but I think I need to cry. Please, Ethan. Please see it. Please free it from its misery. Please, please, please! I don't want it to walk around like this. Please. I kill it. I'll kill it. It's alright. Thank you. A lot. I'll give you a word for it. 
The last time I saw my bell sprout, it was at the radio tower. Man, why'd you have to put so much emotion in that voice? Maybe start cracking up for a second there. Rude. Crack it up? What do you mean? Because it was <laughs> sad. Oh. There we go. Alright! Yeah. That? No. What? Sorry, it's funny. Don't worry about it. Okay, <laughs> so it's now time for so Ethan. Cringe? It's now time for Ethan to live! Oh shit. Oh shit. Oh. <laughs> 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 Okay, I want to get lost like 1 HP, it's fine. <laughs> Squish. Locked. Oh, the video tower is right over there. Get the bell sprout, yep. Uh oh. <laughs> <laughs> okay. <laughs> Jesus. Don't get cornered. Eh. Shit. It's it's oh, it's, it's hard that yeah. it said they can get like a million attacks off at once if you're unlucky. Yeah, I know. <laughs> you're very dumb about it. <laughs> yep. How much HP you have? Check on. Oh well. Right. I Good have. Doctor. I'd say about 15, maybe 17. Oh yeah. No, 16 actually. <laughs> No, it was 15. Oh, 15. Why does it go to list like every attack that they only take away like 1 HP? Something like that. Yeah. <clears throat> okay. No! Stop it! Fuck off! Get out of the way! Piss! Ass! Oh, fuck. Oh, he's smart. He's smart! He figured it out! <laughs> there you go. <laughs> no! It's closed. The owner's body for that order. It's closed! Oh. <laughs> I already forgot that I was doing the voice. Kitty. Oh, whoops. I forgot. It's okay. Hmm. Someone blocked the entrance to Helix Forest with trucks. Do you think this was Harold? <clears throat> hey! There's something on the ground! Looks like... Some sort of checklist. <clears throat> Investigate the gym, block north entrance. Harold isn't here anymore, and he wasn't at the north entrance either. Looks like we have to drop by the gym, although I'm wondering... What is he trying to investigate there? <clears throat> Probably trying to find out if, uh, what's the trainer's name is still there. I forgot the name Whitney? of the trainer. Yeah, maybe where Whitney is. Yeah, the gym leader. <laughs> well, help! Help oh, me! Yeah. I can't believe it. A survivor. Probably that's Harold guy. Quick, let's help him. Holy shit. Did you just yeet her uh, uh, over the fucking plant? That's yeah, cool. I did. <laughs> I was like, wait, did I just see the crowd? Oh shit. Oh, okay. The fucking, the MIDI making it sound like Doom music is great. I know, right? I love it. Oh, hey. Found a berry. Nice. Ow! Uh oh. Oh my, my health! All oh of bad. it! Okay. All of it! No, don't forget you have berry. You have two berries, actually. <laughs> Whoa! Thanks, kid! You just saved my life! Are you Harold? Yeah, that's me! Why? Are you searching for me? Who are you? Don't worry. Dave told me to search for you. Are you alright? Did you get bitten? No, no. I'm totally fine. Everything's fine. I'm freaking the fuck out, man! <laughs> <laughs> Poor guy. We should talk later. Let's head back to the hideout for now. My boy! My sweet, sweet boy! You're alive! Imagine if Dave just said that. Aw. Harold! God bless! You know what? I'm gonna do something funny. Harold RCS Bless! You're alright! <laughs> there you go. Perfect. <laughs> now, it's, now it's nice and silly. We were so worried about you. We already expected the worst. That was a little part of the Pokemon lore. So right? Wait, it works. I'm alive only thanks to this kid and this great lava. I like if we just have dialogue boxes of us just like reacting and smiling and stuff. It's cute. Hey, it is cute. Tell me, what happened? I, I blocked the city entrance to the south, as you told me to. That should prevent the beast from getting here, at least to an extent. Afterwards, I wanted to check the Pokemon gym and see if it'd make more good for shelter or not. We're even to find some more, some, yeah. some more survivors who could have fled into the gym. 
but a lot of these beasts haunted me, uh, hunted me on the way there, and I had to flee into the gym. But of course, they continued to follow me, and I was able to hide from them, but uh, thanks to the maze that Whitney built there. These infected got confused by the maze? Correct. These monsters are unimaginably stupid. <laughs> they only have one thing in mind, eating, and they are very dangerous in large numbers. But it's easy to trick them. Don't forget this. A single one is weak and no danger. But it's almost impossible to fight them in large numbers. But I can't thank you enough for hiding me. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Get me out of there. But that's your name. Damn! <laughs> you know what? That's another thing to the Italian. God. I'm Ethan, and my Pokemon's called Brando. Me. No. Again. I'm but yeah. <laughs> Kitty. Again, thanks a lot, Ethan and Brando. I was wondering, what's the deal with these trucks you placed at the south entrance? Can't we just use them to get out of the city? Impossible. These trucks are trash. We could drive half a mile at best before the zombies would get us. All good vehicles, even all Pokemon that can get us out of here are gone. We're trapped in this city for now. That's why we need a lot of useful resources from all around the city. But we need backup as well. You saw what happens when you're low on the streets, but there's hope. Maybe we could build some kind of boat or a car. <clears throat> but we can't think of that just yet. I'm just happy that you're alright, Harold. That's the most important thing for now. Come to me when you have some news. I'll do that. I'll continue doing my best. <laughs> Ethan, I have to thank you. I don't have anything I could give you for your troubles, but be sure that I'll give you something back eventually. We're all working together, and we'll all try to survive this as best as possible, right? Yeah, but Ethan, you and your Koi Love are the only ones that can safely leave the bunker. So there's still work to do. Yeah. <sighs> but there's no need to worry. Take your time. Come to me when you're ready to go outside again. Oh God, Harold, out of this terrible situation. We are all very thankful for this. My situation will be much worse without Harold. <laughs> why did she? Why did I make her sound sarcastic? Imagine. <laughs> I didn't mean to. <laughs> you are done. I'm deeply grateful. Please take this. Yeah, Pokemon. This potion heals 10 HP of your Pokemon. I don't need this now. That my cute little bell sprout isn't here anymore. Loser. I'm just kidding. <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> actually rude. Hey Ethan. Perfect timing. Need the help of you and your Quay Lava. I couldn't actually. I could not imagine losing a Pokemon if that were if, if I were in her shoes. I, I, I know, I, right? I'd be fucking broken, dude. Especially so important. With it for like your entire life or whatever. Right. That, that, just that happens. Even like, worse, you grew up with it, it's with it alongside your childhood. Even worse. Yeah. Like. Like, you, you're, you're a baby, and it's a baby, and you both grow up together. I'm just stop. That's rude. That's mean. That's that's actually, that is so mean. That is such a mean <laughs> stop. I'm, I'm going to take that back. I'm like, I'm mad at you guys. Because it's sad. <laughs> it is sad. Like, that makes for a really sad short story about a Pokemon trainer saying how good how good their Pokemon was, so much they love, and it just cuts to the fucking Pokemon just passed away, passed away. Dude, fuck that. That's sad. That's a comic idea, and I hate myself for it. Ah! <laughs> right? God. What's so- <laughs> totally distracted myself. What's so important? I lost my toolbox and was running from the infected. If I knew where I lost it, I might tell you where it is. But I have no idea. However, the bike shop has, uh, has a lot of tools. I'm gonna get a Jesus, calm down, dude! Slow down! How do I get in there? I, I guess the bike shop is closed like every other building in this city. That's no problem. I've worked there in the past. I have a key. Here. Ethan received a shop key from Harold. You can open the door with this, and, okay, first off, aren't you supposed to return the key when you're done working at a place? I don't Technically, didn't you just give yourself a, a way to break and enter without breaking and entering? Like, God. are you a thief? <laughs> are you a criminal? That key do you copy keys for people, dude? Anyways, do you really need the tools? Well, <coughs> <coughs> if we have to repair something, then yes. Don't worry, Ethan. There aren't many infected on the streets right now. You should use this to your advantage, and I'll give you a reward for it. I'd love to give you your reward already, but because this will make things easier for you, but I need some time to prepare. I'm pretty sure I can show it to you when you're back. But this isn't urgent. Take your time. I'll talk to you when I'm back then. Alright. I dive. I think we're ready to go. 
Hey, hey my friend. Unfortunately, there's still a lot to do. But there may be hope for rescue. You think so? You have certainly noticed that the mobile phone network broke down. The reason for that is the radio tower had no power. We are able to get it back and running again. Network's still off, though. If we could turn it back on, we could ask the military for help. That would be the rescue for us. I also have a Pokecom with me. I could call Professor Elm. He may know more about this infection. What? You're from Newbark Town and you know Professor Elm? Yes? I got Brando from him as well. Great. The only problem, the mobile phone... Yeah? We can't do anything from here. <laughs> D Dave, did you just have a stroke? Ethan, I'm sorry for that, but I have to ask you for something <laughs> just, like this again. He just drops the thing. <laughs> right? <laughs> but you need to get the radio tower back and running. I understand. Go see Nurse Joy after we talk, yeah? Please? No. Also, I want to know how my mother and my friend are doing. But I think the radio tower was pitch dark inside. Not anymore. We turned on the lights, so you should be able to see something. At least the emergency power should be running now. That should suffice. That sounds promising. Okay. Brando and I will turn on the network and come back here. I owe you a lot, Ethan. This is the first time I'm feeling hopeful we could actually survive this. Well, what do you mean? <clears throat> Nothing. Forget it. I just hope there's no bad surprise waiting. Ethan, you are a big help. But don't push yourself too far, my boy. We are all trying our best, right? <laughs> yeah! Heal your Pokemon. Well, well. <laughs> Did you forget? Nope. Okay. I'm gonna go as much as we can until we, um. Just, we do Get need to heal. Kicked. Oh. Well, you see, that's unfortunate because I wasn't expecting her. <laughs> what told you to heal, stupid? <laughs> nah, we'll see how far we can go. Is this the bike shop? Yeah, it is. There's nothing in here, too. Okay. I mean, you also have potions and stuff <laughs> in your inventory. Yep. <laughs> These tools should be enough. Let's head back, Brando. That's the checkout of this shop. Hey. What's this? I s a note with text on it? Th that looks like someone wrote it with blood. Fat bastard. You usually like bait for the for the know that sort of the zombies. Only for your own ass. They have bitten me. I know I will transform into an infected. But I promise you, I will hunt you myself. With the last of my strength, I've written this message. I hope someone finds it. Joe. Thank you, Totally Not Pilly, writing that for us and me reading yeah. it because of last episode. No, ah, don't worry about it. It's fine. <laughs> God. <laughs> I totally understood and read all of that. Yeah, totally, 100%. Yep. <laughs> Is that a prayer someone wrote? I have no idea. Yeah, it's a prayer of death for whoever fucking comes across it. Right? Toolbox here is empty. I guess Harold took the tools before he lost them. Someone tried to patch this bicycle recently. The latest bicycle collection just standing around. But its use in the apocalypse is rather limited. Yeah. Unless you turn it into a washing machine by putting a barrel on the back wheel. Because that could work. <laughs> Why can't you the ghetto elk shit? Oh god, oh god, oh god. Oh god. <laughs> Jesus. Oh shit. Okay, okay. What? Did that goblet just yeet over the- Okay, well. Damn. T told you to yell. You see, I wasn't expecting two of them. Yeah. Uh, I'm I'm gonna, I'm I didn't gonna... expect that goblet to just jump over the fucking fence like that. <laughs> yep. <laughs> so, so we're gonna cope and pretend that it didn't happen, right? In fact... <laughs> Sorry about that. That was a glitch. I don't know what happened to the game there, but uh, oh it's fixed now. <laughs> I don't know what happened to the game. There was a little bit of a glitch, and we like kind of died for no reason. But it's okay. Right. Whoa! Oh, careful. Why didn't that connect? I know, right. <laughs> <laughs> Jesus. Why are you okay. missing? Hey, Stop! There you Stop go. hooping and hopping! There we go. Hey! It's cheating. Uh, so, like I said. What? But we're not in battle. We're what? not in a ba battle. 
save now? Maybe new, maybe maybe there's like a cooldown. We can walk in the tall grass now? I don't like that. Oh. It's right. closed. The owner's probably fled already. I already save. said this. Try saving you now. Oh, there's still what? someone out here. Oh, but that's why it is. Yeah, it's because there's zombies nearby. All right, where's the asshole that needs putting down? Right. Hello, <laughs> Mr. Monster, where are you? You know what? I, I think like... I'm going to heal first, like you said. Okay. <clears throat> I mean, as much as I like the, the sound of death. <laughs> no, actually, no, the Kingdom Hearts one is better. That's right. <laughs> I mean, also the Pokemon one. Dave, I need to p change pants and just shit myself so I'm the scariest thing in the world! God! I'm traumatized now for life! <laughs> no problem, come back, we need to- wait, what? Did you say no? <laughs> By accident, seems I did, yeah. Oh. Alright, I'll take over for a <clears throat> There we go. Your yeah, Quilava is fully healed. Your yeah, Quilava is fully healed! Imagine she said it oh like that. Oh my god! <laughs> Come back any time! Who's <laughs> that? Hey, hey, Harold! I'm back! And I brought you this toolbox, no you... The whole toolbox? W whoa! Thanks, Ethan! I really needed the tools. I'm sure they'll help us a lot. Oh, I'm glad I could help. Now what's with the promise reward? Of course! A promise is a promise. I had to prepare myself until now, and it took some time. You need to know. I was passionate fire breather. I already saw the fighting style of Brando. I'll teach your Pokemon a new technique. I can teach your Queen Lava Flamethrower. That sounds great! The what best. do you think, Brando? Hello, <laughs> Queen Lava! Okay, this'll take a moment. Come back in a the minute. The best fire type move ever. <clears throat> this is great. I love it. All right. We're supercharged! Yeah! Nerd? Yeah! <laughs> <laughs> cute. Pee pee bar. More like piss piss bar. That was. Piss piss bar. Not even cool. Not even gonna say anything. Thank you. This move will help us against our enemies. Lava, lava, quit lava. That's great. And the tools will help you. That's a lot as well. I can use that old wood there and build something nice. Uh. Can we do a quest for somebody else, dude? Okay, she already said that. Yep. We already dealt with her. We can turn- Oh, the radio tower! That's right! Oh, that's right. I <laughs> think we both forgot. Quilava, use blah! No, we can't do it here. Nope. Because there's no... Dickheads. Save? No, oh. I, already, I already did, Dory. No, you didn't. Yeah, no, did. No. Liar. Liar, liar. Pants on fire. No. Squish, 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 squish. That? No, that's what you get. get you get the squishies. Rude. No. <coughs> da rude sandstorm. You're da rude sandstorm. PC is off. The emergency power turned on only the important things. Sad, too. I was wishing to snag a potion from there if it were possible. Right? Okay, that's just the floors. Gee, I wonder, player, it must be a plant! Do you know what plants oh, do? God. Plants are plants! They photosynthesize, it's so cool! It's so crazy! <laughs> God. Ethan being a sarcastic prick. Is that Team Rocket? Hey, don't move! Yep, it's Team Rocket. What are you doing here? For fuck's sake, you scared me to death! Answer me, kid! What do you want here? Are you one of Team Rocket? Yes, I am. But that's none of your... F almost said fucking business. That's none of your business. If you take one more step, I'm gonna kill you. C calm down. We don't want to take anything away from you. We just want to get to the radio tower working again. So we can get help. Shut the fuck up! The floors above are filled with the walking undead. It's bad enough that the emergency power was turned on. I was hiding all the time down here in the dark, and it's worked until now. And now you want to go up there and lure these horrible things? No way. I won't let you, let you risk my safety. Lest you? But we have... Uh, do you want... Don't you understand this, you little brat? It doesn't seem like it. Guess I'll have to kill you. And your yeah. fucking Pokemon. <laughs> <laughs> 
I warned you! You're gonna die here! Are you okay? <laughs> oh my god, he almost killed me. <sighs> Poor kid. <sighs> Kill him, Brando. Oh, shit. <laughs> Damn. <laughs> Human? Oh. It's okay, it's self defense. It's fine. Come on, no. Let's go. Oh, we can't even check these. Damn. <laughs> My keyboard's probably picking up so loud right now. It's killing no, the it's tension. Fine. <laughs> I mean, it is a little bit, but it's not that loud. It's fine. Okay, so thankfully. Also, scared shit of me. <laughs> okay, so thankfully in this game, um, damage carries over. I'll say yep. <clears throat> so we're just making this easy on ourselves. Yep. Also, why the hell did that zombie scream? <laughs> like, what the fuck? I know, right? Not to say. <laughs> this woman is dead. Blood is dripping from her head. This woman is dead. Right. Blood is dripping from her head. I wanna get out of here or else I'm gonna be fucking dead. The word dead was already used. I fucked up the rhyme. Shit. I guess I'm just gonna go to bed. <laughs> God. Stupid. <laughs> you are literally cute. This woman is dead. Blood dripping from her head. Maybe she should have just taken the day off, gone to bed. There we go. That worked. My God. Stupid. <laughs> Looks like they prepared for quiz questions for the radio show here. One of the questions is, is Nita Arena always female? Someone answered with no. But I don't have the time to think about stuff like this. <laughs> they answered wrong. Yeah. Nita is always female. Fake, I, was about to, I was about to make an unhinged joke, but I think I'm just going to leave it at that. God. You know what? I'll just type it in the chat. Hold on. <laughs> Show you exactly what the fuck I was gonna type. I'm curious now. <laughs> what are you about to say? There you go. I, I put it in the recording chat. There you go. Don't say it out loud. <laughs> just, just, just quietly read it. Horrid, horrid joke. I think I'm about to throw up. <laughs> I love you. Love you too. God. We're but not yeah. battling. We are in a hoose. This is not a hoose. A hoose. Uh, what? Who's Who's What's in here? <laughs> nice. Oh, that's gonna be a problem when we unlock that door, isn't it? Oh yeah. Hi, <laughs> Magnemite. Oi! 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 Oddish! That's not Oddish. Is it? That's not Oddish. Okay, yeah. I, 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 for a second I couldn't tell because I'm not used to seeing it sprite. Yeah. <laughs> oh. Oh yeah, that's right. Damage carries over. Especially in a game where it's undead! Yeah. <laughs> and they're like different colors and shit. So like, fair enough. Yeah. Actually, this Oddish looks more rotten than it does. Interesting little choice of color. Yeah. Let's go. What do you mean? Uh, shut the fuck. Yeah. <laughs> I'll take three hits. Uh-oh. Hello, oh, general manager you... speaking. I'm sorry. God. <laughs> Seems like Thomas, Thomas, no, really? please, uh, please, please, uh, opened up. That's crazy. I didn't know that's something no, opened it's up. No, just that's crazy. ding dong, T Thomas, Thomas, could you please report to the cash register, Thomas? Oh my God! <laughs> God, why are you like actually so cringe? Because it's funny. Yeah, that's funny. Oh, that magnemite's gonna be an issue. Let's deal with that issue. Yep. Forbid. Luckily, it's still tight. It's Ow! Shit. Just fucking bitch <laughs> slap me. Slap you. <laughs> Rude ass motherfucker! Oh, 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 oh. 
And get slapped again. He fucking slapped us. Also, right? this oh. he's a tactician over here. Jeez. Aww. There you go. That makes me Aww. sad. Doesn't make me sad. I mean, I guess it is magnetic. Because it's magnemite. Magnetmite. Shut up. Thank you. It's okay. Oh, whoa, we're taking a lot of damage. Yeah, berries. True. Use the berry. Okay. Some weather reports. Nothing interesting. The, the, the sky is blue! That's the weather report! The body's torn in two halves. How cruel. Oh, well, it's a Team Rocket member. Who cares? Lamau. Yeah. No, nah, I'm just kidding. There's some, just some chill ones. Like Jesse and James. Oh, yeah, that's right. Yeah. And then there's assholes like Giovanni! Yep. 18 o'clock news. Now, homicide. <laughs> All right, let me let me do my radio voice. <clears throat> homicide division DCP. -E uh, yep. Yeah. Well, I was doing it right, and I, I fucked up. Hold on. <clears throat> uh. Aww. The homicide division DCP E31 from Golden Rod City has found out something new regarding the murder in the house of the married couple H. On February the 10th, the husband W H was strangled his wife with a rope and put her body in the bed. The neighbors noticed that the loud screams came from the house of the family H. They immediately called the police. Mr. H told the police that his wife in his bed he found his wife in his bed sleeping and he didn't do anything to her. But some DNA traces were found on the victim's neck and around the rope. Mr. H is now in police custody and the criminal charge against him will start in a few weeks. But Mr. H can probably stay home until then due to his heart disease. I'm surprised I didn't fuck that up, honestly. That was pretty good. <clears throat> I'm proud of you. I like that radio voice, it's fun. I like it too. <laughs> da -na 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 -na. <laughs> Hell yeah! That I love the do. happy Pokemon music. Right? <laughs> a little, it's, a little, it's a little bit of hope to go a long way. Yeah. Now we, should, now we can call for help. Let's get back to the hideout. Uh -oh. You have to get rid of the... Yeah. Yeah. Do it. Ah! I did it. Got it. There we go. <laughs> okay. Let's get back home and save. What was that? Oh! Oh! That oh, let's hurts. go off that, that, metal. That hurts. I know, right? It's steel. <coughs> it's steel. Steel electric? I think it's steel electric. I'm like 90% sure it's steel. Wait, since the radio tower is working, it's probably not going to work inside. But... No, yeah. You can't. Not now. We should probably try crawling Professor on once back in the hideout. I should talk to Dave first. You know what? You're smart because you don't want to attract the attention of anybody by uh, talking on the phone. Yeah. What the fuck? He, he was infected? Uh, flamethrower! Flamethrower! Ember! 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 Oh god. Oh god. Oh god. Ah! Ember! Ember! That's Ember, right? I'm pretty sure he's using Ember. Yeah, it's Ember. The, if it's the super long one, it's in flamethrower. And then if it's the short one, it's in Ember. Okay, at least I remember the moves. He's finally hey. dead. W was he bitten? Also, I just imagine Ethan just yelling at all the attack moves, like, ordering his Koalava to use them. Right. Which is really cool. I like that. I feel like it was somehow my fault that he mutated. <sighs> oh, was it, you freaking poor Bew? I just want to get out of here as quickly as possible. Oh. Yeah, I squished. Oh, shit. I'm going to be a little more careful now. Flamethrower! That's our Ember! No! Flamethrower! Oh, oh, oh! <gasps> no! Oh god. No! Don't oh, okay. Don't forget you have potions. Oh fuck potions. this. Just go just go. Go go go. What make Maggie? Maggie, just go do I swear to god. Okay. <laughs> Use your potions, you if potions. I, if I if I don't if I don't kill them here, I have to deal with them later. I mean yeah. I I think that's all of them actually. Yeah. Don't worry, Brando, you got this. Anything else I gotta clear out? No. Okay, that's good. No. Whew. Okay. Wouldn't the first step be to break into the Pokemon to try and steal? Well, maybe it's already been cleared out, right? Uh, maybe that's later down the line? No! We never got that far in our, our hardcore thing. That's true. Maybe in, maybe in a future thing we'll hopefully be able to. Wait. KP1L1. Oh, I think I'm not sure what those stats are. Maybe that has to do with original RPG Maker stuff. By the way, Maybe. the fact that this is an RPG Maker game, it can't even yeah, I know, freaking it's still tell. Fucking it is so well made. 
Eight. So well made. Eight. <clears throat> Hello, Ethan. I already have a brand new project in mind. <laughs> Just wait for. Oh yeah, I talked to Dave first. Hiya, oh, Dave. Are you fucking kidding me? What's the deal, Ethan? You lured me into a death trap. Admit it. You knew that there. Yeah, you, fuck! I'm so mad I can't even speak right. You knew it. And you didn't even tell me. <laughs> Infected corpses, blood everywhere, and even a rocket grunt. What, Ethan? I swear I had no idea. Are, are you and your Kualov all right? Yes. And we got the tower back and running. I hope you're satisfied. Wait. Team Rocket? What's Team Rocket doing here in Goldenrod? It was just a single guy. S someone who just... Wanted to survive. Aww. Wanted? He didn't make it. Okay. Well, that's not important right now. But you turn the network in Goldenrod City back on. I'm sure your work will pay off. I lost the accent for a second there, but Ethan, I'm truly sorry. I didn't know how bad it truly was there. I thought nobody would go inside the radio tower while the power was out. Fuck it. I just wanted to know how things are in New Bark City. I should call them right now. Okay, first off, we call Ma. We gotta call Ma. Yep. Ma'am, can you come pick me up? I'm scared. <coughs> <coughs> That's not a good sign. Nope. What about Professor Elm? Do you want a voice, Elm? Sure. Okay. Why not? I mean, I'll try it there anyways. Hello, Professor Elm here. Who is this? Oh. <laughs> I, I'm so... I don't know. <laughs> oh, <laughs> yeah, oh, right, I'll do it. Like I'll do it. <laughs> 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 You're cute. It's, so okay. it's okay. It's <laughs> okay. Uh, Professor, it's me, Ethan. Ethan? How are you doing? Are you alright? Yes, uh, I'm alright. Everything's fine. Oh, she just blessed. I'm so relieved. It's so... It <laughs> I, like, I, like, I like that. I like that. It works. <laughs> I love that so much. What's going on in New Bark? How's my mom doing? In is Krista with you? Your mother's all right. Don't worry. Everybody in New Bark Town is unharmed. But uh, unfortunately, Krista began her journey a couple days ago. I haven't heard back from her since then. Mm. Listen, Ethan. The phone network is dead in most of Shoto. I've tried calling yours uh, you hours ago. I own the only working emergency phone. He must have a satellite phone, if that's the case. Probably, yeah. <coughs> satellite phones are just... You know. I don't think he'll be able to call anyone else. Mm. Does this mean... This infection broke out all over... All, all out of... The music is throwing my beat off right now. Shut up! Especially with, especially with the, like, knocking and shit. <clears throat> turn it down a little bit. Actually, I'll yeah. turn it down a lot of bit. There we yeah. go. <clears throat> Does this mean the infection broke out in all of Johto? I guess. <clears throat> Where are you right now? You, do you have a safe shelter? Yes, I'm in Goldenrod in an underground bunker. This city is filled with infected. We're working together to find a way of escaping before it becomes even more dangerous. What's the big city in uh, Pokemon Black 2 again? The huge one? It's like one of the first ones to go to. Ah, uh, shh. Yeah, I don't remember what it's called. <laughs> hey, wait, I'll look it up really quick. Yeah. Yeah, Castilia? You said? Yeah, imagine the breakout in Castilia, dude. You need to know what reason. <laughs> that would suck. Oh, what a mess! We're working together to find a way of escaping, but before it becomes more dangerous. Do you have an idea of how we can get out of here? Do you have any Pokemon left? Anything that you can help us with? Uh, I'm sorry, Ethan. I'm as powerless as you are. <sighs> Once people started to learn about this apocalypse than the undead. Most of them gathered all their Pokemon off the storage system and tried to flee. The people were very obsessed with flying or water-type Pokemon. With those, it's easier to be on the move of all time to keep the distance. But a lot of them forgot that even a Pokemon has to sleep and eat. This method killed a lot of trainers. I, I have no Pokemon left here. I could be any help to you. Oh no. Is there no other possibility? Not even one? As I've said, 
My hands are tied. I'm sorry, Ethan. But it is, it's great that you've found safe shelter. You should be safe for now. Professor, do you know what's happening? Where do these undead come from? Do you know how all this came to be? No, I don't have any information regarding this. What this infection is, where it came from, I have no idea. Do you know if there's any hope for a cure? There's no official statement about this, so... But I'm de delving deeply with the DNA of these beasts. I sent my assistant to a couple of hours ago to bring me a cadaver of one of these undead. He should be back soon. Maybe I could find a way to stop this infection. <clears throat> Tell me, Ethan, how's your Pokémon doing? Kulava. Brando? He's doing great! <laughs> Just hearing Aww. Kulava in the background, like, Yeah, I'm okay! <laughs> I know, right? I'm so glad normal. to hear that. Oh, I slipped into the wrong voice. <clears throat> no, you keep it, it's okay. Yeah, we're fighting these undead- We're fighting the undead together. I've trained it well. You're fighting them? Ethan, you should be very careful with this. <laughs> Every living creature that gets bitten by one of these undeads will become undead as well. Interestingly, I found out that some of these undeads can keep a part of the memory from when they were alive. This means that some humans or Pokémon can faintly remember who or what they once were. I've already seen some infected Pokémon using some of their attacks. Nonetheless, they are still dangerous beasts trying to eat living meat. With or without their memories. We'll be careful, promise. But we couldn't have called you if Brando and I hadn't turned on the radio tower. Professor, turn around. Fair enough. Professor? If it, se if it secures your survival. Ethan! Something very important. Only a few seem to know this. Everybody really... Every single human in Pokemon and Johto is... Oh! <laughs> oh, damn it! Oh, that's why you never turn your keeper back again on the fucking door, you dingus. Pro Professor? Professor! What happened here? That didn't sound good. Oh my god. I hope he's okay. I don't think he's okay. <laughs> no. I am sure we will survive. I forgot for a second. You're cute. <laughs> Everything will turn out good in the end. Hopefully. Anyway. Oh, I got a call. Okay, so. <clears throat> our buddy's mom is not doing so good. So it looks like we're gonna have to. Well, what were we gonna do? Let's check in with everybody. Yep. How are you doing, Ethan? Be careful, okay? Thanks, Melody. Oh, wait, we already, um... Okay, I think we just have to talk to Dave now, but first... Yep. And Folly Heal. You know what? Your... I'm gonna use one berry. We'll stick with 8 HP for now. The, no, I'm going full resource management mode in this game now, that's it. Fair <clears> enough. <throat> and? How was it? How'd it go? What did the professor tell- what did the professor tell you? He said he can't help us. And he also doesn't know where this infection is coming from. He wanted to tell me something important before I did the call, but the connection died. And he did too think. <laughs> I think Hi. something happened, but I don't know what. Oh shit! I didn't expect that. Shit! Really? <sighs> Ethan, I am so sorry, but it seems like we have to secure our own survival out here for another while. Oh. oh. We can't just give up now. Listen, we're not giving up. Come see me later. We'll see what we can do. <sighs> this rocket guy. Did I... Did I have to kill him? What was going on with me? I was... so obsessed with killing him. He was okay, a living human. That... That isn't me. What happened oh. there? I need to get my thoughts back in order. I can't allow myself to become a person that I don't want to be. Aww. 
I can't forget who I am and what I want to become. I am Ethan. I want to become a Pokemon master. But can such a dream still come true in a world like this? Yes. What if this world will stay like this? I just hope that won't happen. <laughs> it's a mess. This whole world's Poor a mess. Kid, man. Right? <clears throat> Go on. I am sure we will survive <laughs> this. I had, to, I had to remember my fucking You're cute. old lady voice again. <laughs> oh wait, do we just have to go after back, back to right now? Yeah. Fuck! Ethan! Just in time! We have a big fucking problem! What happened? When I was talking, taking a walk through Goldenrod, I saw something on Route 35 that will definitely cause us problems. You won't believe it. But there's a big infected Venusaur walking directly towards Goldenrod City. It's so big it could probably climb over the north that way. Okay. It's so big that it could probably climb over the north entrance to Goldenrod City. We're all doomed if we ain't doing something anything about this. Doing something anything about this? Congratulations, English failed. <laughs> Can't we do anything to stop it? With a creature this big? No. I really feel bad for asking you this, but you have to kill it. A Venusaur! Are you stupid? Think! Venusaur's a plant type. Zombies are already weak against fire due to their decay. A plant type zombie shouldn't be hard to kill even a Venusaur. Ethan, you must kill it so we can survive. And you're sure there's no other way? Absolutely sure. All right. It's the only way. Come to me when you're prepared. Are you prepared to beat this gigantic Venusaur? I'm ready. Ready as I'll ever be, I guess. We can go. I didn't heal. But that's yep. fine, because I think we should be able to do this. We know it's pattern. Yeah. Oh dear. It's like every this three. thing is gigantic. Brando! You don't have to do this if you don't want to! <laughs> like, I don't want to do this. I'm kick his ass. <laughs> <laughs> okay. I'll take cover so I don't stand in your way. You can fully focus on the fight. <laughs> <laughs> oh, this song! I love it. <laughs> okay. Oh, it's it's, it's a number <laughs> keys. That's right. Oh yeah. Oh shit. You got this. You got this. I believe in you. Oh. Sometimes the controls throw me off. I'm not gonna lie. Yeah. It's fine, you're good. You're good. We have only like 2 HP, but you're good. 2 HP's all I NEED! There we go. Holy shit, that actually was all you needed. <laughs> okay, you know what? Well, that takes care of the entrance. What luck! Oh, wait. What luck? It's finally dead! The cadaver now blasts <laughs> the cadaver. Sorry. Its body's blocking the Man. exit from Goldenrod City. Now that I think about it, this may not be that bad, actually. You ripped off part of Venusaur and consumed it. You restored 17 health. God. Ugh, we're hurting. But that's okay. Yep. Maybe use that Nurse Joy thingy. Okay, so these two can be called... Yeah, we got we got no numbers now, but there's one more number here. I'm wondering, is that a number we can add at some point? Maybe. Hmm. That'd be interesting. Oh, now I can do the Dracula voice with the old man. There we go. <laughs> yes. Oh, a new face. Hello. Mm, good evening, young boy. If I'm allowed to introduce myself, my name is Albert. Dave brought me here just now. <laughs> you could say he saved my life. Wait, no! Hold on, wait! <clears throat> I have to speak like the Count! I got the wrong voice! I have to speak like the Count! One uh, one dead Pokemon! Ha ha ha! Two dead Pokemon! Alright, there we go. I'm sure you're Ethan, right? Uh, Dave was praising you for all you've done for the group. 
And I've only heard good things about Martha, so Martha! Sorry, Batman v Superman, gotta make fun every time. <laughs> well, uh, yes? No false modesty. I see that you have a Pokemon with you. A Vulpix! <coughs> <coughs> I'm infected! Just kidding. That's a pretty strong Pokemon. Man. We can work together. I'm afraid that is not possible, Ethan. We only attended beauty contests. It's very weak, unfortunately. If I had known what misery was coming, I would have trained it. Oh, that would have been good to know too. That would have been too good to be true. <clears throat> ah, whatever. Right. Ethan, before you go, I have something for you. Come back to me when you have time for it. <clears throat> I like it. I, I like that voice room. I like it. I like it, dude. <clears throat> like it's not too over dramatic. All right. Yeah. I'm, I'm, I know you voiced this guy last time, but I think I have a great voice for him. All right, ready? <clears throat> Let's make him depressed the shit. Hi. You're the Pokemon trainer, Ethan, right? Yeah, that's me. Dave told you about me, am I right? Yeah. <laughs> exactly. The rescue of all of us. He said you're the one taking care of all the rumors. My name is Klaus, by the way. Before this disease broke out, I was a police officer working at DCP-31 apartment. Not so much is obvious for that. You can tell by the uniform. Yes. Smartass. <laughs> I knew Golden Wrong long before the outbreak. It's scary how fast everything's changed. I was working oh. on the first couple of infections as if we didn't have to do more than enough with Team Rocket. The disease came out on top of this. In all of Goldenrod City, these cruel murders began. Until we realized that it was... Until you... you <coughs> Sorry, my throat choked up a little bit there. You're cute, it's okay. That you get infected through bites. Then everything fell apart and everyone survived on their own. Cruel. The things I've seen. Rumors that hate the humans and Pokemon. Nobody should have seen to see, to see that. I'm talking too much. Anyways, as I, as an experienced police officer, will do everything in my power to help you. If I just had my pistol. Hey, maybe you can help me with something. I have something to do for you. I have something for you to do. Come to me again if you have some time. <clears throat> will do. <clears throat> Poor guy. Right? I am sure we'll survive this. I forgot. Everything will turn out good. Yeah. Oh, she always says the exact same thing. Yeah. We have to wait for two safety girls. Hey, Ethan, I just had to try out the tools, so I built this wardrobe out of the old wood. <laughs> hey, that's cool! But, uh, what do I do with this? Well, you could collect the outfit. You could collect outfits in it, I guess. Uh, He's like, uh huh. Huh. <laughs> God. <laughs> when the shit hit the fan, a lot of people left their stuff behind the, in, in, due to the panic. You can find pieces of clothing all around the city and store them in the wardrobe. Then you can change your outfit here all the time. I mean, wouldn't it be bad to change clothes? Uh, excuse me? What do you mean by that? <laughs> well, uh, uh. Pokemon trainers are traveling day and night. I always wondered when they changed their underpants. From a hygiene standpoint. Well, yeah. so I, I am changing my underpants regularly. <laughs> but I guess the wardrobe is useful anyways. Thanks. New clothes would g give me some variety. You're welcome. I wanted to build something anyway. Take care of yourself. God. Oh! Oh! Oh, shit. Okay. Wait, what? That was the pile of wood from before. Yeah, I know. But like... Okay. Huh. Well, let's talk to the old man. Hey, young boy, I remembered something. When I fled from my place together with Dave, I forgot something important. I left my radio module at home. You have a pokey gear, right? Uh, y yes, but what does that have? What, I mean, what use does that have? There were no survivors in the radio tower. Besides, there's a radio tower over there next to the beds. The radio over there is just a normal radio from an electronics store. 
That does not help us a lot. But if we were to install the radio module, maybe we can get some more information about this disease. Maybe the military or the disease control center sent something about that disease? And maybe there's a place for survivors, or maybe even a cure. At least I hope so. The hope dies last, young boy, all right? I'll get the radio, Mario. It sounds like a good chance. Can't let it slip. Wonderful. I believe this as well. Here, you need this to get into my house. It's near the bike shop. You can't miss it. But be careful. I've developed a small, let's call it security system. It was initially thought of as something that confuses thieves so they don't steal anything. You have to know, I'm passionate master of the... I almost said it completely differently, wrong. <laughs> Thank you. Uh, fun, uh, funny puzzles, there we go. I almost said something bad by accident and slipped up. <laughs> it's, 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 the English language sucks, man! <laughs> but you are smart enough to figure out the solution. Got it. I'll give you the module. Trying to reach someone from the outside is definitely worth trying. I think we have to talk to the officer again, too. Hey, you two. I think so, yeah. I could help you kill some of these roamers. That would be awesome! Brando and I need any help we can get! But I can't do anything as long as I don't have my pistol. Beating the roamers yeah. melee? No chance. They would turn me into dead meat in mere seconds. Those bastards would be happy about it. No way. Listen. I was one of those survivors that get hit in the game corner. But that was days ago. I don't think they're alive They're alive anymore. Yeah. But when I noticed that the infection was reaching the game corner, I fled immediately. I, I took the key, ran inside, and locked the door behind me. I had no other choice. It was either me or them. I was horrendous. These... Cries. I, I can't forget them. Oh. I I'm sorry for all the humans that were still in there. Such a world, we all make mistakes sooner or later. Mm. Okay. I... I don't know. Maybe I could have saved them. Maybe. I'm sorry. I digress. This, this is about the present now. So, to make it short and clear, my pistol's in the game corner. You need to get it and bring it to me. When I have my pistol... I could shoot some of these stink heads. Stink heads? They, they just call them stinkies. <laughs> <I> love it. <coughs> That's amazing. What do you think? Sounds like a good idea. I'm sure we could pacify the game corner and bring it to you. Before I forget it, here. You could unlock the game corner store with this. Last time I passed by, I didn't hear a sound. But be careful nonetheless. <coughs> Understood, officer. Yep. Save. Okay. This is the one of the other, those few times we're gonna use, um... <coughs> we're gonna use that. Oh shit. Okay. We have four left. Actually, yeah, because you only have, like, two each. Yep. It's a good thing we're going so fast through this. We're, over, we're an hour in. An hour and ten right. in, and we're, we're over to here. Alright. You really cannot tell this is an RPG Maker game. Let's say hi to the um, <gasps> adorable Bullfix. Aww. <laughs> Aww, baby. Bullfix! Bullfix! So cute. Hey, so you gotta do the Pokemon Christ. You gotta. I, we, you really do. <laughs> Alright, so let's do all these side missions. <clears throat> yep. This is one of those games where it's actually fun to do the side missions. It really is. Alright. This is home. Okay, here we are. Albert's home. So that's what he meant by a security system. It looks like these stones are fake. I should be able to move them. Okay. Here we go. I believe in you, you can do it. You did it before. No, that's not gonna do it. No, I believe in you. You can do this. I may have screwed the puzzle. Yep. No. Gotta go back. 
It's not. It, it's not. No, it doesn't. Not, it doesn't look like it. it. Does look like. <laughs> like it makes it look like. Oh, you have to make a path. Like, I wish my. Yeah, mouse, no, and I, then it's like. Yeah, like, picture it in my head, right? Like all the way to the right, down, and then right, and then up. But then you just block yeah. everything in. Yep. <laughs> so here's what I'm gonna do. I'm gonna try and get rid of as much of these as possible. Okay. You got this! Perfect. Hell yeah. Da -da 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 -da. We should bring it back to Albert. He, sur he surely knows how to use the radio module. <laughs> Let's check and see if there's anything here. A normal radio. You think there's still so, so there's still someone hey! Do you think there's still one still sending? I don't. A beautiful image of a field. Different books with crossword puzzles are stored in the shelves. Bring some home so Melanie can have something to do. Alright. I would. I would do. I'm sure you can't pick up a TV signal here. Well, we already Damn. saved beforehand, so... Yeah. Um, oh, that's a train station. Um, we need to go to... I... Ah. The game corner. Yeah. There we go. One of these fuckers yeah, wakes get, up, watch. Yeah, 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 yep. Oh, you're lucky. Yeah, I was about to say, like, I remember there was a jump scare moment. <laughs> ah! Yeah, you fucker, you moved when I was gonna... Fuck you! Fuck you! <laughs> You got this! <laughs> I'm not losing my perfect health! And I. Son of a bitch! No! Okay. Oh, what's this? Oh! <laughs> well. Hell yeah. By all means. Blue outfit. We got the blue outfit. Please tell me there's something in the trash. <laughs> yes! Yes! Ah, <sighs> beer Thank God. Beautiful? Beautiful. Beautiful. <laughs> okay, so remember the hint from earlier that said, um, facing a large group of them is dangerous. Yep. Yeah, we're not gonna deal with that. Yeah. Maybe we can go back <laughs> in to take a peek. Nope, not happening. Nope. That was incredibly <laughs> close. Oh my god! I know, right? <coughs> I wonder no, if you have to you. kill all the zombies to get the true ending, but... Right? Hmm. Or, like, yeah. one of the endings, maybe? I, I don't know. I think I might do that, actually. I'll save I here, know. right? And we're gonna go back to the playground, and we're gonna see if we can kill them all. Okay. Because maybe that might factor in a true ending. Maybe. I mean, they don't respawn, so... It's a thought. True. Who knows, maybe it's a secret way to level up. Maybe. M make our Quilava into a Typhlosion. There we go. Oh shit. Oh shit. Oh shit. Oh shit. <laughs> Get him in line like that, yeah. I think. Okay, one, one down. Two down. Okay, two. Come on. Come on, come on, come on. Come, on. come over here, you little... Okay. Wait. I think we only lost two health from all of that. Okay. Yeah. I think I noticed they only take out like one HP. Just gotta Let's strategize our moves, that's all. Check your thing just in case to make sure it's really just one HP turn. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay. Good. 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 Perfect. Yeah it's, yeah. it's like one HP every time they hit you, so. <clears throat> this is good. Uh, where's the second entrance? It's here, right? Yeah. Yep. <coughs> no, this is, this is great. That also means we, like, we're good to strategize like, what to attack, how to attack. Yeah. <coughs> to an extent. So let's save. Until we fuck it up again, but you know. <laughs> yep. You found it. Very good, my boy. Now let us see if the military or disease control center is sending anything. I've got like Skyrim voice actor mind going on right now, so it's kind of mixing in. Because you're fucking cute? <coughs> no. Yeah, huh? <sighs> Bad news. Nobody's sending uh -oh. anything. But. S somebody has to be doing something against this disease. Right. But it does not seem like it. 
I was so certain that the government would not let us down. And now this... This... No police, no military, no disease control center that could help us. Nobody! We are completely on our own. I am so sorry for sending you out there and getting this. But the radio module is useless if nobody is sending. But it has an integrated music player. I have no use for it. You can have it. <coughs> the music player is now installed on your Poké Gear. Simply open the Poké Gear and select the music icon to listen to songs. That gives you a good diversion every now and then. But right now there is only one song on it. There are songs scattered all over Goldenrod City in which you can collect. They will be added to your music player automatically. You should also visit the places you've already been to. Maybe you can find a song or two there. Thank you. A bit of music will calm me down for sure. <clears throat> Heck yeah. You brought it with you? P perfect! The pistol's even fully loaded. Looks like it wasn't even used. Whatever. Time to kill some monsters. Get their ass! <clears throat> Hell yeah. I was outside. Man, these beasts are getting more brutal. I almost used my entire magazine. I could I kill that. a lot of ro I could kill a lot of the roamers. So you'll meet fewer of them. I was also able to hurt some of them. It should be easier for you to fish them off now. That helps us a lot. Thank you. You're welcome. Well, that's, just, that's just all I could do for you. Good luck to you too. <clears throat> oh, there we go. Yep. Ethan? Come to me, please. I when you have some spare time. Of course. Hey, love boy. You need to do something important for me. It is really important. Before this catastrophe, my husband and I ran at the Pokemon daycare. Many young trainers came to us, so we would raise their Pokemon. There were wonderful times. Uh, oh, I'm sorry. <coughs> I digressed again. But I just remembered there was a Pokemon egg in this daycare. Oh, but I can't remember which Pokemon was in the egg. If it's a water or, or a flying type, that could be a chicken out of the city. Possible, but that doesn't matter right for now. It is a living being that still hasn't been born. You know, just just out of nowhere. <coughs> hear me out. What? Some people might say, "Oh, well, where's Ho during all this?" Because remember, he was able to save oh, those yeah. Pokemon from the from the uh, whatever it was tower that was burning. Yeah. And turned them into legendaries. <coughs> I'm going to be entirely real with you. I like the idea that no legendaries right now, as we know it, for now, are involved. Yeah. Because I, I have, I, I feel they know the risk. And they can't, yep. they literally are not taking part because they know damn well if something happens to them, it's going to make it worse for everybody. Oh, definitely. Especially like Arceus, the fucking yeah. god himself. Because the, like, you know. the legendaries are smart as shit. Yeah. For, well, most of them, if I'm not mistaken. So, uh, like, I have, I do yeah, feel they would like, be like, no, I'm staying yeah. out of this. Except for, like, a handful, like, God on Kyogre. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> I mean, Rayquaza could probably do something, but if there's a zombified flying yeah. type, it's over. He'd be like, no. Yep. Besides, Rayquaza's looking out in space right now, trying to make sure nothing's coming in. Deoxys! <laughs> yep. <laughs> <laughs> oh my god, Any imagine a zombified Deoxys. <laughs> Any the Ultra Beast, fucking Necrozma, who's even stronger than Arceus? Imagine. For like zero reason. Imagine. God. Imagine Deoxys. Zombified. God. Reminder no. that it could shift in a different form. So imagine they all amalgamate into just one fucking oh, form of zombie. There we go. <laughs> nope. That's comforting. <laughs> Shit. <sighs> and it's not fair that it is such great danger. Could you bring the egg to me? Yes. I'll get the egg. I'll get the egg, Martha. Martha! That's I need to stop. Great! Thank you, my boy. <laughs> Here. I'll give you the key. Okay. You could find the daycare on Route 34. When the eggs are set on a pillow. 
Just take it and bring it here. But please be careful. Shaking the egg could cause it to break, and the Pokemon couldn't survive that. I'll be extra careful. Okay, here. So here's my game plan, right? What? <clears throat> okay, first of all. Some new new clothes. Okay. Game plan. We check out all the other buildings we went to f already first. See if there's any yeah. music tracks. <coughs> <coughs> then we go to the oh, daycare. Okay. Sure. There could be a possibility we have to clear stuff out too by doing this. So that's what we're going to do. That's our game plan for now. Yep. Simple, sweet, to the point. This is where the first song is. I still remember from playthrough zero. <coughs> <laughs> Two of six unlocked. Good. Hell yeah. That means we don't have to go on a like a super collectathon, and it's not that huge of a game either. So that means it no. will be. Oh, oh, go to the gym. I mean, so far we don't know if we can go to like Hoenn or Kanto. I mean, <coughs> that's true. <coughs> what, if all, what if all nine regions are in this? I mean, probably not. Three years. Oh, halfway there already. I, I honestly just took a guess, honestly, but that's good. <laughs> um. <laughs> We hey, how many do Poke you have Poke gear? Poke gear? No, I think we're only oh. in the Johto region for now. I mean, we're, then again, yeah. we're still stuck in this city, so... Uh, uh, can I just say, this is a really, really, really good game. I am right? really enjoying this one a lot. Made on fucking RPG Maker of all things, too? This is, apparently, this is a that. really, really old one, too. If I'm not mistaken. Yeah, 2000. That's what it said. Well, I don't know well, if that, that was, was 2000. But yeah. Um, search out when was Pokemon Dusk release but there's two versions of remastered dusk. yeah there's remastered and then there's um, one was pokemon dusk remastered no that's <coughs> not how you spell remastered released there you go yeah see if you could find also 2013. Just, yeah but there, that was a remastered what? there should be an original version too oh the original uh <coughs> well the remaster is 2013 apparently so it's like super old wait hold on let me actually um, go onto our channel, right? Go onto the episode zero. So I actually left the wiki as a link in the um, what's it called? In the description, so people can get to it and download it. The, download the remaster. Well, what if I'm, I'm lazy? Gonna, I'm gonna do it for the this one too, so people can just get to the link. <coughs> it, sh it shows both oh, the okay. links for that one and the remaster. Like the download link, you mean? Or <laughs> yeah, it'll it's it's got the download link, but it leads you to the whole wiki page about the entire game, including the older versions, so... Oh, shit. Okay. <clears throat> yeah. So you should be able to find what you're looking for there. Don't scroll too much into the page, though, because that'll tell about endings and stuff and what to do, and, you know. Oh, okay. <laughs> there we go. Uh... Let me just copy-paste the link, because apparently I can't just click it. Google's like, or YouTube's like, no, And I'm like, okay. <laughs> Boop, boop. Oh, there's something in the grass! <laughs> Green outfit! Da, 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 da. I knew I was gonna find something in the grass eventually. Yeah, oh, to the. Uh, 2013. Okay. So, like, three years later, it got remastered. Yeah. Also, hello, Resident Evil 4 save music. I do, I, I do like that. I do like that. I like the Resident Evil save music. Anything on the PC? No, can I save here? We can. No. <laughs> nah. Nothing in the trash can. Nothing in the fridge. Nothing there. 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 Okay, we just get the egg now. Yep. <sighs> okay. Oh, she so just wait. Oh, she just blessed. The egg isn't damaged. Nonetheless, I need to be careful. I can't let it break. Or oh, this was all for nothing. <laughs> Scared oh, the shit. shit out of me. I know, right? <laughs> This shit it's a manky, too. dude! <laughs> oh, it is a manky. With a little pacifier in his mouth? What? No, its, ma it's mouth is just blue. What are you doing? Can you like come over here so I can like, attack you, dude? There we go. There you go. Oh, his nose is blue. Huh. Oh, he busts through the window. No wonder why it was so loud. Alright. Song 5 of 6! <laughs> One more. And that's her husband. Oh. That's sad, man. Fuck you, Gabe. Well. That made me sad. Fuck you. 
Okay. It's time to make it or break it. Oh! Oh shit. Hi, Otis. How are you good? Nope. Okay. Oh god. Okay. It's one down. Yep. There's that polywag. Is that oh another shit, member of Team Rocket? Rocket? Member. He's missing an arm. Yeah. Oh yeah. Now he's missing his brains. <laughs> yep. <clears throat> Always lots of them. Yep. He's missing an eyeball. Now he's missing the rest of them. Yep. I'm just making sure to clear everything else out. Yeah. Just in case if it leads to an end ending. Yeah. Well, there's that polywag down there. I'm gonna take it. Yes, get there it. is. Get him here. Get him here, little guy. Okay, okay, okay. Shit. All oh. right. Uh oh. Come on. Come on. Come on. Risky. <laughs> Risky move. I know. Right? <laughs> Jesus. Come on, come on, come on. Well, come he's on. in you the corner. Want yeah! There. Yes. What a shot. Perfect. Fred. <laughs> yep, proud of you. Okay, so we've got five out of six songs already. Good. Hey, this time the egg didn't get damaged. In the hardcore thing, we got damaged like one time. Hey, we might actually get some... Listen, we're, do we're doing everything we can here. KP-17. Hey, what? <laughs> what? Oh, maybe that's the health? What? Wait, check your Pokemon's health again? Oh, it's supposed to be KP... What? Wait, I'll go- wait, what? Eh? I'm confused. Is, is it just me or get brighter in here? Also- Oh wait, hold on. Oh, okay. There you go. You found the egg! Wonderful! You must know. A young life has to- like that has to be protected. Thank you two. Thanks to you, another life was saved. Here. Dave just found this. Your quill of us sure has- Kitty? I can't fucking read. We got an HP up! Good! Hell yeah! Lavi! Go Lavi! It's like all excited, bouncing around and shit, like all happy. <laughs> right. It's time for the start, I just imagine. I'll take care of the egg for now. Good. Why did they scare the egg? I'm wondering which Pokemon's inside. <clears throat> I know I've saved like a million times, but now I can actually save scum in the game. And alright. I like the blue more on honestly. I, li I, li I love the blue on him. Yeah. <laughs> I mean, the green is also cool, but I don't know. <clears throat> something with the blue one I really like the most. Yeah. Uh, I think we talked to Dave, Dave again? Yeah. I think we did all the quests. You and your Koila are a great team. Listen, oh, you have thanks. a few bullets left, but um, please consider don't use them on yourself because you do not look happy. You do not sound know, happy. Right? Please do not. Right? How'd it go, Ethan? Could you beat it? Yeah, we were able to kill it. Corpse of the Venusaur lies in front of the north entrance. I guess that entrance is blocked for now. Great. Really great. We all owe you a lot. It's alright, really. It was for our safety. Yeah. But don't forget that we're not taking for granted what you're doing for us. It's okay. Hey, did you see? Brought some new survivors into our hideout. This gentleman at the table was locked in his house for days. Could have starved to death that I didn't get him out of there in time. This police officer came from a bigger survivor group that hid in the game corner. A couple of days ago, I met someone from his group on the street. The guy was shady. Maybe that's why the officer isn't part of that group anymore. He wandered around these streets aimlessly. Got lucky that I found him before the zombies did, but... Whatever. <clears throat> you should talk to them. Maybe they can help you. You should talk to Harold as well. He prepared a little surprise for you. Yeah, I saw the ward- wait. Yeah, I saw the wardrobe. I think it's great to have something like this in the hideout. Great! We can talk about the next topic then. Let's Chicken. You. Thank you. Hey, buddy. Our options of leaving this city are shrinking. There's one thing we haven't tried yet. You know the high speed train in the Golden Rod City? No? Doesn't matter anyways. That piece of junk ain't working. Our great, me our great mechanic, Harold, could get it work again. Thanks for the tools you brought him. I knew he'd need them soon. Whatever. If we can get the train working again, we can leave this crumbling city. Why didn't we think about using the train earlier? Well, the underground here is filled with infected. Getting through this is going to be no easy task. But it seems like we don't have a choice. Uh, the high-speed train? That could work. 
safe way of getting far away from here. This idea sounds promising. Ha! <laughs> I'm glad you like the plan. Harold unlocked the door to the train station. Sit next to the radio tower. Go to him. He's already waiting for you. He'll let tell you what to do. Alright. Um. Hi. Uh. Oh, yeah. <laughs> I was like, the egg is doing great, but it'll take a while until it hatches. Okay. Oh, okay. Let's check on you. Okay, you're, you're saying the same thing. I think, say, yeah. Okay, Lava is absolutely wonderful right now. She's yep, just asking us how we're doing, and he's probably going to say the same thing, too. Okay. You still have, like, two berries and one potion? Yep. We're not losing any of that today. Nope. We're trying to keep as alive as we can. If anything, we're doing way better than we did in um. Oh, definitely, hundred <laughs> percent. Like every, like what, every battle? I think we're always at the red HP. Yeah. <laughs> They're just kicking our asses. <clears throat> Perfect timing, Ethan. If we want to use a magnet train, we have to restore the power first. I could repair the electricity, but to get there, you have to clear a way through me uh, for me through the walkers. But if we manage to reactivate the train, we can escape from Goldenrod City and head for Kanto. Hell yeah. Don't know if that's going to be any yeah. better, but we'll see. Just walk across the plat <laughs> just walk across the platform across the wooden plank and head right. That's the train station underground. The electricity box should be at the end of the hallway. Hallway's very long and there's another problem. The underground is filled with walkers. And there are a lot yeah. of infected Pokemon there as well. I've seen some of those infected use their attacks. Be careful. There are some poison type Pokemon as well. They'll try to attack you with some poison attacks. It won't cause an infection, but your Quilava might get poisoned afterwards. If Brando's poisoned, it'll lose HP over time. Here. Take this. I hope you won't need it. <coughs> An antidote, nice. If you run out of antidote, Nurse Joy can help you as well. But don't worry, the, the poison won't kill your Pokemon. It vanishes at low HP. And one more thing. There are other infected Pokemon who attacks can confuse Brando. If he's confused, he'll walk around uncontrollably. The confusion will go away after some time. Good luck. I'll wait here and come once you're at the electricity box. I was gonna say we never got it. We never got poisoned even once in the hardcore thing. So hopefully we <laughs> yep. keep that luck with this one. It's just a matter of being very careful. Yep. <clears throat> well, here's the thing. Electric train. I'm not sure if the power is gonna hold up. But if it's able to hold up to get the Kanto, that means the Kanto still has power. Yeah. And if we still have power, that's a good thing. But what I'm thinking is. We could also we run into red. Hopefully, red's I even in this game. Maybe. That'd be really cool. Worst case scenario is we just have to take the train back to the city. Yeah. Back if here. The cancel's just as bad as uh, Jono. Yeah. How's the high doing, man? How are you doing? Oh! Man! Rude. Okay. There you go. Check every trash can, every box! Yep. Very dangerous. Yep. Wait. No, I thought that would work, no. actually. I'm alright. Nope. Nope. <laughs> Nothing in the toolbox. Okay. Garbage can? I mean, at least the humans can't poison you. <laughs> That's true. Shit. Uh, okay. It's mostly only the Pokemon that can. Well, he wasn't even near me. Okay, cool. I know, right? Gotta love it. No. <laughs> oh, God. Eh, <laughs> eh, stupid. There we go. It's, a, it's, a, it's more difficult because it's an RPG maker. Yeah. <laughs> like, you run on a grid. Yeah. Left, right, up, down. Perfect. Yep. Ooh. Dodge that one. Oh god. Oh god. Oh god. <laughs> Sometimes okay. you don't turn around when you want to, but that's, that's yeah, just no, a maker thing. It's no, I don't want to yeah. I haven't seen that. Oh, I before. think it's because there's You see that up there? I didn't notice oh, that. Yeah, before. what is that? The tombstone? Huh. I wanna know how to get there now. I know, right? What the hell? Hi, Gamer. How you doing? Oh, I got hit by something. Ow! Oh, we're poisoned. I see our HP bar slowly going down. Oh, we stopped. Stop now. Okay. 
Yeah, I saw it going down for like like five thingies and then it like just stopped. Five pixels or whatever. I don't think they're gonna do that to us. The um attack every wall until you find the hidden entrance. Yeah. I don't think they're gonna I don't do think that. they would I don't think they would do it. <sighs> okay, well <clears throat> This is indeed a long hallway. Yeah. Come on. Come on, stupid. Oh, shit. Uh oh, oh. <laughs> Sorry, I'm going silent. You start really. Yeah, really no, trying it's, to like, focus. it's like really tense. <laughs> God. <laughs> nope. You got this. You got this. Doesn't help that some of the attacks miss like that. I know, right? I guess it's mimicking real Pokemon. That fucking hurt, dickhead! Maybe. Oh, maybe. Actually, yeah, that's a good point. Sometimes they do, they do miss. Use the... Yeah. Well, hey. I don't want to use too much too, on, too fast. Yeah. Especially when... I mean, if you... Oh, no. Well, yeah. They'll probably see episode zeros by now. Well, especially when we get to Whitney. Um, a spoiler. <laughs> I mean, I'm, I'm gonna I'm gonna schedule this like well after the episode zeros of the hardcore mo oh, okay. world. So yeah. It's not like it doesn't really matter. Jack, Jack Blue was Blue here. Was here. Was there anything mentioning a Jack Blue? No. I mean, wiki? there's a blue, there's a trainer blue, which is like the rival of red. That'd be Even though in the Japanese dub, his name is green, the rival, but in the American one, it's blue. Oh. And people always fight to go over it. <laughs> oh, Ooh, whoa, whoa, nice. oh, hell yeah. There's only one song left. Yeah. Oh, where would that be? Oh, nope. No, no. Hmm. <laughs> oh, whatever the case. Yeah. Psst. Hmm? <clears throat> My heart just skipped a beat. Sorry, the electricity box should be at the end of this hallway. <clears throat> Sounds good. Bruno and I will lead you there. Just stay close to us. Okay. All right. Then let's. God damn it! <laughs> God damn it, dude! <laughs> oh! Oh shit! How did you find something? I've got to. Whoops. Brando, quick what? attack! Or quick attack! Harold! What? You. You. You got bitten. Yeah. He hit, hit my upper arm. Shit! Upper arm, so I can't sh chop it off. It's easy. Fucking shit! Listen. It's not like that. I'm infected. I mean, maybe. I mean, maybe I'm not, right? Right? Everything's alright. Okay? Oh. Uh, fucking hurts. Yeah, I imagine. I didn't come that far to die here. Nothing happened here. Alright? Everything's okay. Yeah? Everything's okay. We keep doing our work. Let's check this electricity box now. Go! Uh, uh, okay. Man. Oh boy. <clears throat> what if you can save after this part? So there it is. Any fight? Let's see what's wrong with that crap. Huh? What's wrong? Yeah. Someone else was here. 
Train, it's not gonna work. I mean, someone was here and destroyed the whole fucking electrical system. I don't have the electrical pieces to repair that. Yeah. Fuck! So what now? I don't fucking know. I am so fucking angry right now. Nothing's working. Nothing! My arm feels like it's burning. Uh, we're done here. Nothing to do here. Let's get back to the hideout. <clears throat> How will the others react to do a spit an arm? Normal. Oh. Yes, we can. Oh. Go ahead. Maybe there are some other monsters left. What? No! That's not possible! Hey, isn't that... What are you doing here? Whitney? The gym leader? I thought she fled! Tell me! <coughs> what are you doing here? Hey... I forgot she's like super... she's super cutesy. <laughs> oh, jeez. Hey, keep calm. We're survivors, like you. We wanted to restore the electricity to start up the train. So we could flee from Goldenrod City. Although that plan is dead now. Someone damaged the electricity box. Exactly! I did that! I won't allow you to start the train. Are you fucking insane? The train is our only hope! He's right. What's your problem with us wanting to use the train? <coughs> oh shit. Huh. You wanted the hard way? Alright. What is she up for? That oh, shit. Your last chance to get out of here. Ethan! That bitch is going crazy! You know what? We should get rid of her. I mean, she won't let us escape. We're all gonna die because of her. Either we die or she will. What? No, are you insane? She's a human being! I can't! Maybe she's just scared or stressed out of the situation. We've all had hard times. Okay, uh -oh. you really want it that way. Oh shit. I love the fucking Pokemon music. Miltank, it's your turn. Miltank, Miltank. I have no idea what Miltank sounds like, so shut up. Seems like we have no choice. I don't Brando! Remember. Go! Oh, great. Okay. Well, save. Oh god. <laughs> okay. <laughs> Holy shit! Shit. Oh god. Already in the red? Jesus! Oh, uh, Miltank's meter is insane. I know, right? Oh. Damn. Okay. Let's try this again. Yep. It's gonna happen eventually. Yeah, I know. That HP bar is insane. Fuck! <laughs> shit, shit, fuck. Uh -huh. The goofy and uh, MIDI music, by the way, the MIDI rendition. Right, right. Uh, right. God. Oh god. Okay. Oh, thank goodness. <gasps> right? Nothing chill. Nothing chill. <gasps> okay, it's halfway. It's ha- no. Whoa! Okay, now it's halfway. <laughs> Fuck. Potion? Maybe? We have no choice! We have to use yep. our potion! Good thing you saved all those HP bars before this fight. <laughs> yeah, tell me about it. <laughs> Shit. Nothing chill! <laughs> chill the fuck out, you asshole. Stupid ass cow. <laughs> Like, literally, because it literally is a cow Pokemon. Shit! Yeah, like, stop! Leave us alone! Go away! <laughs> you <laughs> used Rollout and you screwed up every other move of yours. Congratulations! I know, right? I mean, it's working and that's the problem. Yeah. Stop! Stop! 
<laughs> go away! Go away, you stupid freaking Pokemon! <laughs> we got this! We got this! Oh god! Wait, hold on, I'm getting a phone call. Oh. Whew, okay, I'm back. We got this! We're so close, we got this! <laughs> right? Come on, come on, come on, come on! One more hit, one more hit, probably. Please! <laughs> one more hit for the <laughs> both of us, I think! Yeah! Oh! It's just. Holy shit! <laughs> Milton, come back! If you send out another Pokemon, I'm gonna cry. I know, right? Please don't. Please, for the love of God, don't. Please don't. Please. 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 Mm. You were lucky. This time. The fuck do you mean this time? I know, right? Oh, here. <laughs> She's gonna catch another Pokemon, I swear to God. I hope that was the last time you've seen of her. Well, let's go back. Holy shit. Let's try, please heal us. God. And there was nothing you could do. The electronics were damaged this badly. Gym, li gym leader Whitney. Yeah. The gym leader Whitney caused the damage. She's completely crazy. Ethan could get rid of her, but that didn't fix anything. <clears throat> the only thing we could do is try to repair the electronic parts and repair it. I see. Hey, Harold. What happened to your arm? My arm? That looks like a bite mark. Tell me. Fuck. He got my upper arm. But I'm feeling good, I promise. Maybe I'm immune or whatever. Oh, but you're sweating. Your body temperature seems to be higher than normal. I... I'm okay. Trust me. Harold, you know, we can't take the risk of having an infected in the safe shelter. Yeah, but I don't have to be infected. Maybe some people get- only some people get infected. As if you're believing that yourself. I'm sorry, Harold. We can't make exceptions. What? What do you mean by no exceptions? God. You really want to kill me? What oh. else are we supposed to do? You bastards! Ethan! After him! Can I heal for- Oh, shit. Really? We even got the heal. God Harold, damn it. don't move now. Why? So you guys can kill me more easy? Fuck you, all of you. Man, calm down, you two. I'm sure there's a solution. There isn't. The only solution God. is killing him before he becomes dangerous. I wanted to solve this peacefully at first, but you don't have the choice if you react like that. You guys have lost your minds. I'm human and not a danger. Well, you aren't a danger now, but once you've mutated, you new are one. This is about the safety of all of us. But I've already told you that I'm feeling fine. I'm sure I'm not infected. I don't think so. I could see it in your eyes that you're not okay. It's because I was on the road with Ethan, nothing else. Yeah, of course. That's obviously the reason. What are you trying to do? Dave's right. You don't look healthy. Even to the untrained eye. But Dave... Harold's helped us a lot. Killing him after all this would be beastly. Maybe he earned it to choose his own death. Ethan, I know it's well intended, but the risk is too high. What if he mutates and tried to ambush us? We could all die just because we let him live. Ethan! Kill him before he endangers all of us! Ethan, please, let me leave. I just want to be alone, please. Man. Man! Run, Harold, as fast Dave. as you can. I can't kill someone who's helped us so many times. I'm sorry, Dave. Thank you. Thank you so much, Ethan. Oh. Hey, I like Harold, too. Fuck you. Man. Ethan, you idiot! Shut up. Haven't you learned about setting priorities after everything you've seen so far? Who shattered your brain? My god! I get back in. What? Asshole. Ooh. <laughs> I mean, yeah. I mean, like. Mm. Man! Oh, 30. Wait, what? Oh boy. 
Okay, we already said all that. Da da da. Harold's toolbox. What a gift for him to be here. I know, right? Ooh, I like the purple. Fuck yeah. I really like the purple. <laughs> I really like the purple. There's something on my mind. What? What? You're not gonna heal your po- <clears throat> there's, so there's something on my mind. And it has to do with the subway. Shit. We'll be fine for now. It's just... Because I'm pretty sure we've already killed everything down here. Station. Oh, okay. I want to know what that fucking hidden gravestone area was. If oh, you want to find, find it? Out. Yeah. <laughs> can I... Okay, we can't do anything there. <laughs> I feel there's something secret. You. There's got to be a way to get to that grave area. They wouldn't show us that if there wasn't something important. Right? Like, whose grave is that? Like, what? Could it be useful, too? That's the other question. So we're going back. Thankfully, all the zombies are already dead, so we don't have to worry Watch about it. Watch it be like a story thing, and then we have to go back here anyways. <laughs> I would cry. <laughs> God. Well, it's worth a shot regardless. Yeah. <clears throat> okay. Beep, 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 beep. It's totally not annoying at all. Don't worry about it. Okay, so there's, there's nothing important here. Okay. Mind you, we're still missing a song too, by the way. Yeah. Oh, I hate how silent that part was. <laughs> I don't like it. <laughs> Uh... No. Okay. It doesn't look like there was anything of importance here. Nope. <laughs> well, let's go back. Let's go talk with yeah, Dave. That's, that's gotta come back at some point, whatever that is. Oh, definitely. <clears throat> or it's just a secret passage. Maybe. And we have to push something to get to it, I wonder. Hmm. That is an important thing to note, though. That could be really important. Yeah. I'm not maybe that leads to Maybe that leads to the true ending, knowing what was in that grave. <laughs> maybe. Or something, I don't know. Whatever the case, that's not leaving my mind throughout this entire playthrough. Forget that. <laughs> that seems a little too important, you know what I mean? Yeah. Because, like, why is that there, you know? <laughs> yeah. What reason would it have to be there? Yeah. If not to go there at some point. Okay, uh, we can't push any blocks. There's no stairway that leads to us from here. No. Chekhov's... Was it? What's this? Wait, wait, wait. Yeah, wait. I think it's... Yeah, Chekhov's gun or whatever. Oh. Can't put a gun in the story without having to use it at some point. Yeah. The thing is, you'd know yeah, more about stuff than I still me. remember shit from my storytelling major. <laughs> yeah. And you're just fucking cool because of it. That's why sometimes in some games when like they don't use a thing, I get really pissed off about it. Because I'm just like, mm, yeah. you're breaking the rules of storytelling, you motherfuckers. <laughs> <laughs> Gotta love it. Yep. Where would Dave be? Maybe the bicycle shop. Let's see, let's see if we can find him first off. Well, Dave's in the shelter. You, oh, you mean Harold? Uh, Harold, Harold you sorry, yeah. Maybe he's in the Pokemart yeah. in the Poke Center. Maybe you found a way in. Locked. No. Locked. Yeah, because where would he go? Yeah, where all the would he go? Both entrances are blocked. He wouldn't be in the games room. No. <laughs> there would be no sense for it. Fucking bloodbath in here, by the way, goodness. Right? Jeez. Uh, let's look around Daycare? here. Daycare? Maybe? Yeah, I think the daycare is completely empty. I mean, he could be hiding in the daycare. Or inside the trucks. Nah, I, think I already just checked the trucks. Uh. <sighs> oh, okay. <clears throat> Vault. 
<laughs> there's nothing through here. So there's definitely no. got to be another area because we still have one song left to find. Yeah. Maybe it's in the Pokemon art. The, the final song, hopefully. Maybe. I don't think the Raider Tower he'd be under. What about this building? Locked, okay. We're at the two hour mark already, but I feel like we could finish this game. Yeah. I don't think this is gonna be a long ass ROM hack, honestly. The fact that we can we call it we confuse it with a ROM hack just shows how good this game is made. This RPG oh yeah, it's not a ROM hack, it's like it's literally an RPG maker game. <laughs> I think even. Yeah, because ROM hacks they they literally the the actual thing. <coughs> Shut <Yeah>. up! <laughs> it's okay, you're cute. I don't know how to talk. Thank you, Nurse Joy. I appreciate you. There we go. So two left. We have. We cannot rely on others' help, unfortunately. We have to act ourselves. Yep. All right. We'll Talk. check on the egg, and then we'll. All right. Save all three. Still nothing. Still nothing. Still nothing. Well, it's probably all. I don't want to. And I don't understand. Copyrighted, yep. Yeah. <clears throat> Ethan, I'm sorry, but letting Harold get away was absolutely stupid. Shut up. I hope you won't regret this choice later. No, oh, whatever. Harold was an important member. His craftsmanship was valuable to us, and now we're left with nothing. What do we do now, Ethan? <sighs> what now? I can't tell you, I have no idea. Come on, Dave. It could be worse. But it could also be a lot better. I feel like the number of infected is growing. Our supplies are sufficient for now, but how long will they last? Due to the new survivors, our consumption's increased, even without Harold. What if we have yeah. to stay here for weeks or even months? I mean, what if there are too many infected out there, and we can't take a single step outside? There's no way out. Not a single one. Neither Relax Forest, no Route 35 are an option. Man. <laughs> oh shit. Oh shit. Oh, that's what it looks like outside. Oh god. Route 35 is flooded by infected. Going there would be suicide. Same with the Relax Forest. Damn. Yeah, no, it is a lot. So. What should we do? Starving? Get eaten alive? Both choices are horrifying. I hope it won't come this far. Oh, God, he's doing the wrong voice. Oh, me too. Now that I think <laughs> about it, there's one thing we haven't tried yet. What about the train rails that lead out of the city? Oh, boy. If you follow the rails, you'll walk into a large, dark forest and heavy fog. You want to try that? Since that seems to be our last hope of leading the city, I think so. I never thought of this because I found it too risky. That's very brave of you, Ethan. I've risked so much trying to get out of here. I can't pass on this last chance. Fair enough. You're right. <sighs> All right. Go ahead and find out if we can escape from the city walking along the rails. But be prepared. You're walking into a dark forest. Tarsius knows what's waiting there. Well, that route's actually safe. And you come back to us. Bring us there, all right? Of course. And I'll stay here and think about a backup plan. Take care of yourself. Thanks, buddy. Egg is doing great. Yada yada. Okay. Already there. Okay. It's a good thing we healed, because now we're going to do some really ballsy shit. <laughs> yep. <coughs> here we go. <coughs> this is going to get dangerous. Oh, definitely. This is totally new territory for us at this point. Yep. After the Whitney fight, this is entirely new. <laughs> oh boy, here we go. Ooh. <laughs> Just nope. <laughs> I'm sorry, that was really funny. <laughs> it's okay, cornered me right by an exit, too. And alright, fucking jerk. Oh god. Okay. Ooh, the fog increases at points. Gotta watch out. No! Oh. Yeah. Been on that. Ow! Oh no. It's okay. We're good. We're good. We're, We're good. Confused. We're confused. We're confused. Oh, we are? Oh, no. Well, now we're not, I think. Okay, we're good now. 
Okay. No! Ah! It's okay. We're good. We still have like more than enough health. <laughs> and alright. Okay. Oh boy, tree. Wait. <clears throat> if only we had cut. Yeah. Looks bad. Real. <laughs> okay. Oh boy. Let's do that. Is that a? Hi, pincer. Good news! Great! Fucking chill! <laughs> Jesus. <laughs> okay. <clears throat> Running around tall grass doesn't seem to be. Yeah. It's not tricking any of wild Pokemon, which is cool. I guess because we're all in the overworld. <clears throat> yep. <laughs> okay. What the hell could be in here? Oh. Damn. Oh shit! Scared the shit out of me for a moment. An infested hanging from the ceiling, but it looks like it can't reach us. I'm wondering what happened here. Lore? I think it's very clear what happened here, buddy, but okay. <clears throat> Lore time? Maybe. Nope. Damn. An old Nintendo console. I don't have the time eh. for this right now. The fridge is completely empty. Oh shit. Diary of a train station employee. Oh, oh shit. Oh shit. March 17th, 2000. My day started as usual. Like every morning, I checked the tracks and removed any stones and branches. It's nothing unusual to see an overrun, we overrun Weedle or Paris on the tracks. However, the shredded whooper laying next to the tracks is unusual. Huh. Oh no. It didn't seem like it was hit by a train though. It rather seemed like something tore it to pieces. Whoopers don't have any natural predators as far as I know. At least not around here. There was almost nothing. <coughs> Whoops, excuse me. Okay. Left of the dead Pokemon, but I buried the remains in the forest. Looks like the next entry wasn't written on the same day. I've just witnessed a fight between a Poliwag and a Pidgey. Those Pokemon look very aggressive. Something's wrong here. Poliwag and Pidgey are very peaceful Pokemon. In the wild, these two species never fight under normal circumstances. That's true. I'm pretty yeah. sure. Does urbanization have something to do with that? Are they forced to fight for shrinking territories? That's my theory, at least. Can't see them anymore. They've moved out of the view. Tomorrow I'll take a closer look at what happened outside. <clears throat> March 18th, 2000. I took a closer look after what I saw last night. The polywag who fought against the Pidgey was torn to pieces. Lost both eyes, no tail anymore, and the, the lower body was Damn. missing. Jesus. Scariest part is it was still alive somehow. Oh God. The sight made a cold shiver run down my back. I've never seen something this dreadful. I was sorry for the Pokemon, so I ended its pain and hit it with the shovel. I've also buried it. I haven't seen the aggressive Pidgey anymore. Time for a break after this terrifying event. The next entry was written after his break. Since these events, I feel so constricted. I'm pretty sure that this isn't just my head. The forest has become very quiet. Bad touch. Bad touch. Yep. <clears throat> yep. Oh, Usually boy. the Butterfreeze fly around happily and the bubble stores that grow up nearby show up from time to time. But at the moment, everything is quiet. A bad turnaround of nature? Did the Pokemon notice something? I have no idea. I'm curious whether the people from Goldenrod City noticed anything, but I can't leave my current post right now. Didn't they want to install the promised phone line? This takes forever. But I can understand that this isn't an easy task for the house in the middle of the forest. And I turn- and- oh, Also, I turn on the Goldenrod news, but everything you can hear through the radio is- The tired groaning of humans? I don't know, it's very strange. Could just be a temporary malfunction. I'll keep my senses sharp, though. I'm wondering when the last magnet train passed by. <coughs> We're getting a lord dump! I'm loving this! Mm -hmm. I love this. March 19th, 2000. When I woke up this morning, I couldn't believe my eyes. There was no dead Pokemon on the tracks, but a dead human. It's just like the Pokemon from the last couple of days. Poor guy was torn to pieces. I need to do something. I'll go to Golden Rod City and inform the police. The next entry, the next entry was written later that day. <coughs> I couldn't go to Golden Rod City. Oh God. Suddenly, there were all these aggressive Pokemon with their red glowing eyes that tried to hurt me, hunt me. I fled. <laughs> they didn't get me, luckily. I was like with the Pidgey and the Poliwag. I knew immediately I had to run for my life. I think I'll stay here for now. Thanks to the chaos of the last couple of days, I've completely forgot how to buy food. And I've completely forgot to buy food and drinks. Oh, shit. 
<coughs> March 20th, 2000. The outside became much more dangerous. I'm too scared to leave my home now. There are too many aggressive Pokemon running around. There are also some humans among them that try to attack and eat each other. What the fuck is going on here? What is the reason for their behavior? Is it the air or the water contaminated? Will I become like that as well? This is the first time I've been yeah. scared in a very long time. <coughs> Excuse me. This entry was written a while later. They stand in front of my door, scratch it, make dreadful sounds. I can't sleep anymore. I can't stand this anymore. March 21st, 2000. This morning was relatively quiet. Once I turn on the lights and be silent, these beasts leave me alone. I couldn't get any sleep last night anyways, because I'm too scared to sleep. Sleep deprivation and thirst is driving me crazy. I drank my last bottle of water last night. I really hope this chaos returns back to normal soon. <coughs> wow, this guy wrote everything. I know, right? I love when people put this much care into their stories. Right? March 22nd, 2000. Today, a lot of people fled from Goldenrod City towards the forest. Bad idea. They all died. Damn. Some of them knocked at my door, and I really wanted to open the door, but these beasts were faster and tore them to pieces. I'm trapped. It was a big mistake taking this job after as a train station employee. Should have stayed in Saffron City. Imagine how that's going right now. This thirst is unbearable. Oh shit, he's from Kanto. Cool. <clears throat> I have to stay in here quiet and alone. Also, yeah. I can't keep this much, much longer. March 23rd, 2000. Thirst. My throat is dry and it hurts. Die of thirst or get eaten? I want neither. 24th. I will soon die of thirst or get eaten by one of these beasts, but there's another way. May God rest my soul. Or Arceus, my soul. Damn. He committed, su he committed suicide one day before we got to Goldenrod. So he hasn't been dead for long, and he still became infected. There's one small, further small known. <coughs> if someone reads this, a long time ago, I hid something at the apricot tree next to my house that could help a Pokemon trainer. Good luck to you and your Pokemon. Oh shit. Thanks, buddy. Also, I'm so sorry. <sighs> yeah, Thank that made me sad. Rude. The apricot tree next to. Oh, there it is! Oh! Mm! Hell. Oh shit, we got like a whole ass <laughs> at the health bar. Cool. <clears throat> Thanks, dude. Appreciate you. Rest well. I mean, I'd like to put him out of his misery, but the game's not gonna let me, so. Nope. HP up. That means things are gonna start getting tougher now. Mm hmm. 100%. Yep. Must <clears throat> be nearing endgame then, in that case. Probably. Oh, the tracks are blocked. Oh boy. I mean, I'm assuming. Because, like, that little box is full now. <coughs> yeah. So, I'm assuming it's bigger. <laughs> and longer. Oh, oh boy. Secret. Oh! Not good! Bulbasaur! And Ivysaur. More like Upsetty Sore and Upsetty Sore. <laughs> oh. Don't you dare. Don't you do it. Oh, oh his bulb oh came god, off! Oh god, he removed the fucking bulb off its back! <laughs> Jesus, what the hell? No oh, fuck. Leafeon? Yeah, there's a Leafeon. Sorry, oh, it, it jumps! It hops at you! Wait, is it Leafeon or is it... Oh, it's an Umbreon! No. Can I see, like, the... Okay, it's an Umbreon. It's it's a bulb, it's now it's a nothing everything. left of it, Breon. Yeah. I'm trying to, like, name the Pokemon, because... Why not? Oh no, what are the bulb... Oh no, both bulbs are something like the missing eye. For babies. Conservation idol. Oh. Ah, you fucker, you tricked me! And alright. Love tricks. <clears throat> Stop it. Okay. It's <gasps> making that little alleyway. Okay. It's a lot of apricorns and a. Probably a. Modern outfit. Modern outfit? What the hell? Interesting. Anything in the water? No. No. Nope. How much HP does? <clears throat> 30 HP. 20. So we basically have max HP from base game right now. Yeah. Alright. <laughs> Alright, here's what I'm gonna do. You wanna try out the modern outfit? No, I'll just save the game real quick. Ah, okay. 
Here we go. You never know, man. <laughs> never know. I still want to know how we're gonna get down into that, um, grave underground. Oh, poor fucking Weedle, dude. I know, right? Jesus. <laughs> the star. Look in the water. The star, you. Oh, God. Oh, no. <clears throat> They've all been, like, fucking mangled. This is sad. Jesus, right? Wait, can I press E? Oh. Oh. What if. <clears throat> well, I think I dragged whatever the fuck Pokemon that is. Poor Umbreon. If you know, its tail got, like, fucking. There's something I don't okay. like about this. What? <clears throat> During his notes, there was a constant mention of a lot of them, and all we also saw on Route 34 how many of them were walking around. Yeah. Why is it so quiet? And why are there already so many just dead? Like, I know they attack each other. Red? Maybe? I don't know. Silver? I don't know. Giovanni's oh, son. shit! He's still out there. That's a problem. He's gonna fuck yep. us up. Hi, Sector. <laughs> Caesar is when he turns red, right? Yep. Okay, just That's double the, uh, the, the max, the evolution. So there's Scyther's the baby version. Oh, man, his head popped off. Jesus. Jeez, man. Yeah, my current head cannon is maybe Silver's the one who's doing all this. It's Giovanni's literal son. <laughs> maybe. The Q bone! Oh no! It's missing its fucking eye! God. Poor little baby. <laughs> oh, Literally. Because it actually is just a baby. Potion. I'll, oh, I'll take you. it. I'll take it. Yeah. Thanks, game. Appreciate you. Okay. What comes next? It's a lady. At least she can't hit you from far away. Like, on my Pokemon. Gotta take it real easy here. There could be a secret item back here because of behind the rubble. Oh, like another CD? Another. Whatchamacallit? No, sadly not. Damn it. I'm taking a look yeah, I'm, everywhere I'm still, right now. Yeah, I'm still keeping in the back of my mind that we're still missing one more music thing. <laughs> yeah. Bulbasaur now! Close. Is that a primate? Oh. I think that is a primate. Oh shit. That scared shit out of me. Just that enemy <laughs> scared shit out of me. Is that Professor Oak? No. Looks, the sprite looks like Professor Oak's. No, it's not. It's just a random old, late, old man. I can never mean. Look like the seven gym leader. <laughs> but it's not. Oh shit, wait, you're right. <laughs> oh, oh Lord! No, it's, it's newspaper, I think. Uh. Oh, the there's tracks. another lore. Oh, dear. It's not Is doing that... so good. Oh. It's the man, old man. Ah, oh, I can't read it. Oh. Team Rocket. I see bullets. Yeah. Or bullet casings, at least. Yeah. Maybe we should pick those up and bring them with us. Or maybe not. Can we save in here now that we've killed everything? Fuck. Okay. <laughs> well. Good try. Good try, good try. Also, hi, fucking Poliwrath. Poliwrath. Poliwrath, because it has the inky eyes. Also, Slonix? One slacks. Oh, Slowpoke. Never mind. Because it has the little thingy on the tail. Oh, shit. Cutscene. Why do I have a feeling I know what that is? Doesn't look like there's any infected here. I think so too. Is that what I fucking think it is? I think it is. Nonetheless, we should take a look what's in front of us. Uh, if that works, we're out of here don't soon. Touch it. Yeah, no, we're. Yeah, don't touch it we're yet. Fuck <laughs> off from that. We know exactly what the fuck that could probably be. Mm-hmm. And I don't like it, especially because it's that big. I was high whooper. How you doing? I mean, besides being a zombie, but, you know. Nope. Don't. <laughs> it's hard to remember exactly where the entrance is to these places Yeah, I know. Are. <sighs> it's very, very, very hard to see. It's a good thing these lights are here, at least. Right? 
Oh boy, what a mess this whole place has become. Well, I think we have to touch the funny, the funny rock, and I don't like it. Ah. Uh. <laughs> Wait, if we could just save right here, what am I doing? No, that's right. What if we can? Oh, thank God we can save here. Okay. Okay. R really? It's not. Huh. Okay. Well, I'm not complaining. <laughs> that could be an <laughs> that could be an onyx. That could be the fucking what is it, bowl doer or whatever? It's like the jail dude with the just just a big round. Oh, go golem. Yeah. But golem's not that big. Maybe an onyx. <clears throat> well, it's we saw that Venusaur. Oh, yeah, that's true. Oh boy. Oh fuck. Oh my god. Oh my god. We we can never get through here. Hmm. This is our last hope of leading the city. That would have been too good to be true. There's a giant um roly poly oly thing there. I don't know. I have a good little idea. I'll bring brainstorm. Yeah? Well we're not gaining anything by standing around here. Come, Brando. Let's get back. Oh why does something th why does something tell us when you go back it's gonna wake up? Oh absolutely. Oh, maybe that's why that's there, though, so you can get out of the way. When it... Oh, God. Fuck, oh, I knew it! I oh, knew it! Golem. Hi, Gollum. How you doing? Hi, buddy. Holy shit. What is that? Uh, an infected Golem? We can't go back. We have to fight our through. Our... We can't fight our way through so many at once. Then we just have to fight this Golem. It's a wrong type. Melee attacks won't work. Hey, oh, oh, shit. shit. Wait, do we actually have to fight? Okay. <laughs> oh, jeez! Earthquake! <laughs> I think that's... Yeah, rock throw and earthquake. Jesus. Oh, fuck. Oh, God, come on, I know. How the hell do we... Oh, dear. Wait. Oh, this is gonna be it. This is gonna be tough. This is gonna be tough. This is gonna be tough. <laughs> 14 HP. Okay, so I have to trigger this. Okay. Well. <laughs> Save? Yeah. I don't I don't know how to fight against that earthquake. <laughs> Maybe there's a specific spot we I have think, to go. I think when there's the cracks, I think you just have to avoid those crack markings. <clears throat> Maybe. I'm assuming because you were taking damage when you walked into those cracks on the floor, so... <laughs> I don't know. We can try that. Let's see if that works. Just don't step on the funny cracks. Break your mama's back. I think we can't even save. Yeah. Yep. Trigger the cutscene. Hi, Golem. Hi, buddy. Come on. Come on. Come on. Let me try going here. Okay, we okay, yeah, so just avoid that fucking- the, the cracks on the floor. Yep. Okay, we got the- we got the- we got the thing now. Oh, shit, you walked through it. That's fine. Ah! <laughs> Jesus. Walked into early. Okay, our goal here is to just keep using flamethrower. Yep. Yeah, because it hits from farther. We'll go to the barrel. <laughs> Come on, use it quick. Thank you. Good boy. Okay. God, he takes some damage. Oh, yeah, that's right, because it's a ground type and you're a fire type. So that's why it takes like, double the damage. Whoa. I like how I forgot. Like, why do I take so much damage on Earthquake? Gee, I wonder. It's fucking ground type. Like, don't throw it on oh. fire and it goes bye-bye. So that's funny. Come on, Rando. You got this. Right? Come on, Rando. Believe in you. That's an awesome boss battle, by the way. Right? Get your shit yeah, like checked! Oh, shit. Oh, fuck. Oh, thank God we beat it. Holy shit. Wait, what if he tumbles down here and knocks out the rocks that were below? Oh, maybe. 
Or... Or we have to push it? Whoa. That was unexpected. Let's get back quickly. We have no business here anymore. Never, never. Oh, we're not gonna push it? Okay. Well, maybe later. This is gonna be like a story thing. It's like, yep, push the funny rock down the thing. Here we go. Yeah. Listen, we're alive. That's a good thing. Mm -hmm. Please no more. <laughs> Please no more. <laughs> we are like really low on health. We went our, through our last potion doing that too. <laughs> yep. Oh boy. Oh, we <sighs> get another one. At least for, for doing pretty okay so far, at least. Hell yeah. <coughs> Way better than we were doing in the hardcore run. Oh, definitely. <laughs> we're getting our ass kicked in. Oh, yeah, that's right. Can't go through you. <laughs> yeah. <coughs> how do we get to that gravestone? That is still in my mind. Yeah, and how do we find it? Where the fuck is this last CD? Yeah, where's the last music track? <coughs> hmm. Wanna double check to Goldenrod one more time, see if we missed it. We're just actually stupid. <coughs> Maybe. Cause we found the other five in Goldenrod. <coughs> I don't know. We can try. We can just look, look around, look see. Make sure we didn't miss, <laughs> miss anything. Cause you said we were being back. Yeah. Weird being back here. After everything that's happened. That's right. Oh man. Are you gonna use that the second to last thing with Nurse Joy or not yet? Uh maybe, I don't know. We'll see that maybe Dave will give us a potion. Also wanna see that Ooh! Oh, oh, oh. Ooh! Oh, Ethan looks fancy! Final boss, Ethan, there we go. Right? He really does look like a final boss looking ass. <laughs> God, that's a cool. Oh shit, 7 HP. This is all fucked up right in. Okay. <sighs> How's the egg doing, Martha? The egg Good. is doing great, but it'll take a while. Okay. Oh. And, could you find an escape room from the city? Well, that's wonderful news. I didn't expect that to work, to be honest. Why should the forest be free from the infected, hmm? Fuck! Hey, calm down. We're all alive, right? Yeah, that's the only saving grace. But for how long will that stay true? What do you mean by that? Well, we will run out of supplies sooner or later. I count it. We won't last forever. While you were in the forest, I checked out the department store. Ethan. Oh, shit. The department store should be filled with <gasps> a lot of supplies we can take. Trust me. I don't want to starve in here, and I don't even want to think about eating another human. You get it? Yes. I don't want to do that either. You know what I want to say to this? I guess. I was only able to get into the first floor, but the upper floors? No chance. Security lock locked the door when the power went out. But the basement? The third store has its own generator, but I don't have a damn weapon to defend myself with. Ethan, I am so sorry. So I should go down there and start on the generator and collect the supplies? Yeah, nobody can do this except you and your Quilova. You understand the importance of this. Our life depends on you. I don't want to rot down here, never! Never! Nobody wants that. Do you think there'll be any infected in this store? I have no fucking idea. I'm starting to hear their groans everywhere every time. It's horrible. Damn. So could you get the supplies for us? <sighs> I guess there's no way around. Thank you. It means a lot to all of us, and especially to me that you're doing so much work for us. As mentioned, the department store is open. You can walk down to the basement and turn on the generator. You should be able to access the upper floors afterwards. <laughs> I just had an awful thought. Hmm? I'm predicting right now. What if something happens to Brando, then you have to use the, the, the Pokemon in the egg as our new Pokemon. Oh god! <laughs> I, just, I don't know why that just crossed my I mind, wanna. and I hope it's not true. <laughs> I really hope that's not true, because I'll be sad. But like, god. You are so cringe for that. <laughs> You're welcome. Listen, it's your fault. Teach All right. angst, okay? We're not going to heal, because we're going to assess the situation first. Okay. Dave said the generator is in the basement. 
once that's back on, I can search the floors upstairs for supplies. Fairness market. Six floors to this place, a whole ass dungeon. Yeah, no. Yeah, I remember the I, I remember the Yeah. <clears throat> what was that? You just like a million thoughts at once. You're cute. Well, I know Trainers Market has all the potions and whatever. <laughs> yeah. What was the other things I forgot on the the, the map? No, nope, you're not gonna look at it. Okay, we'll fuck you through then. The elevator's out of service. Wait, what? Oh, the stairs right there. <laughs> I love you. Love you too. <laughs> Wait a minute. <gasps> Wait, we're in the basement of the apartment store. Does that mean we can find the grave that was under the train station? Oh, maybe. Yeah, this spot leads to it. By the way, why is it so fucking quiet down here? I know, I hate it. <laughs> I was about to. Mm. Wait for a jump scare. It's waiting. Uh, there's gonna be a chase. Coming. There's gonna be a chase. I, I'm calling it right now. There's gonna be a chase. I know, scene. right? Oh, definitely. Oh, God, what if Harold's down there? What if Harold's down here? <laughs> oh, he might be. And then he, we have to run from him. Because Ethan's like, oh, no, he's our friend. I can't kill him. And then we really have to run away from him. Mm -hmm. I don't like why is it so quiet? Stop. <laughs> There's an open electrical box here. Okay, they, they give us dead ends, but I've remembered them already, so. Yeah. I mean, it's pretty straightforward. <clears throat> what? There it is. Why is it all like blood? Oh, maybe it's like a tree or something in there? Shadowy tree? Okay, done! Uh. <gasps> oh fuck! Uh, oh <laughs> shit! Oh, fuck. <laughs> okay. <laughs> oh shit! <laughs> Run! Oh yep. shit! There's no way we can find. Oh my god! Holy fucking shit! <laughs> <laughs> shit. <laughs> oh, she's steam oh, tube playing, oh, steam oh, tube playing oh, on top of it. I know. Right? Oh shit! Wait, actually though, it is actually how she's steam. That's awesome. Works a little too well for this moment. <laughs> <I know. laughs> <laughs> Holy fucking shit! They're starting to move faster. Yep. Oh shit! Oh shit! Oh shit! Go! Oh, this is fucking horrifying. Right? With the RCS theme in the back. <laughs> Jesus. Oh, oh. oh my god! Oh shit! Oh, oh, oh shit! They were fast, so fast we almost didn't make it. Jesus. What? I don't blame you, Ethan. Oh, Ethan threw up. I was like, what? Lost oh no! I see no key during yeah, this well, game. That's fine. I don't think we need I to am back not back. going down there again! <laughs> yeah! <laughs> Fuck that shit. Why were they Dude. so fucking fast? <laughs> I know, right? What the hell? Don't tell me that's another. Oh god. Oh god, what if that's a mutation? Wait, what? Oh, the. I also hate you get uh, Evans. Oh shit. That was incredibly close. Um, I know, right? Please, supplies, supplies. No, of course. <laughs> oh, hey, found it. Is that the music? Is that the, is that the fucking music or? That was the music. Uh, like. Nope. Oh, nope. we gotta heal. No, nope. we gotta heal. We gotta heal. Yeah, go to Dave first. We got the supplies. It's become back here. very obvious that we need to heal right now. <laughs> oh. You notice how everything we've killed stays on the map? Interesting little yeah. detail. Like, I don't know if I like that or not, or if there, there's something <clears throat> going to happen with all those bodies. I, I can't even remember if you have to code shit like that in. I don't know. I have no idea. Also, why don't I say body? I started to think of the, the, <sighs> you know, the. The bodies. <laughs> Kitty? <laughs> just like as soon as I said the word bodies, my brain just thought of that song. You're cute, it's okay. <laughs> oh god, this is our last one after this. Yeah. Well, there's one more left. But That's yeah. what I'm saying. That's our la we had this our last one now. Shit. We heal after this, it's done. Can we check what those supplies are? Oh, okay. Well, fuck you too, I guess. Cool. Oh, you can. The supplies have been collected for the hideout. Cool, but is it like potions or like you're not gonna tell us? Okay, fuck. Well, it's you. definitely food. Yeah, probably for the hideout. <clears throat> yeah. Okay. 
Maybe an upper flush, or maybe use potions. I hope. Well, no stone unturned. Let's do this. Yep, let's check every single floor. Hi, Jigglypuff. <laughs> Whoa! Oh, Hi, hit, hit my top, stop! Hit my top, calm down. Hit my top, chill. <laughs> it's okay, it's okay. We have, we have, our, we have our second. But more, more supplies. supplies, okay. I think that can help us. No, and then she's, yeah. Hi, Dynamite. Oh god. Stop slapping us, rude. It's very rude. Okay, I'm strapped with this place. Yep. There's the supplies down there. Oh man, I'm starting to take way too many hits. I know, right? Good music, by <laughs> the way. Could you at least get a bottle of water, right? To f feed, give it to Quilava? Yeah? Yeah, right? Yeah, because bottle, bottle of water heal. Oh shit. I Arbok. Or Ekans. No, Arbok. We're losing way too much health, way too fast. I know, right? Mm. Yeah, I know the elevator's out of service! You don't need to tell us! Alright. Fuck, 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 fuck. Okay, okay, we're good, we're good. What level would you estimate that Nikoi Lava's at right now? I... Since we only know the, two, the few, uh, Ember... And well, the when you get to Goldenrod, thing. you're about, like, level... You should be around level 20-ish? <coughs> maybe 18, 19, something like that? Huh. I, I'm assuming, like, we're, we're very close to leveling to evolving our Quilava. Because 36 is when it evolves into uh, Typhlosion. And usually by the time you reach the fourth gem leader, you should be at type evolution at that point. You're, you have your final evolution. And we've been fighting like, a lot of battles, so I'm assuming, yeah. We have to, we have to be really close to getting, getting a type evolution. Should be last point. supply. Let's get out of here. He said. Yeah. Well, we could, there's still one more floor. What's the roof? Oh, there's a purple. Is that the final CD? Please. Yes. <laughs> Pokemon team cover. Ooh. Wait, don't tell me it's the actual yep. opening. I wanna be the better dad. What? Oh shit. Oh fuck, that scared the shit out of me. Well, at least not Pokemon, so we're good. That's a mother and her daughter. Oh god. Oh wait, you're right. Used to be. I'm shit. Sad. I really, I'm really curious about that Pokemon theme cover. Alright, let's get out of here. That is a horrifying hey. moon. Please, no surprises on our way out. It would be very appreciated. Hey, please no jump scare if we're, like, really low on health. I mean, we're not that low, <laughs> but, like, still. We're low enough that it poses enough of a threat. Yeah. Don't let me pop through the door, please. <sighs> Bill's key. Well, Bill's house is literally right there. Yeah. I won't need this anymore. What if you do, asshole? <laughs> oh shit. Is it is it lower time? It might be more lower time. Potion in the computer time too. An old Pokemon nope. storage system. The Pokemon centers n have newer models. Oh. So we're not gonna. Okay. <clears throat> yeah. A normal radio. You think you're so? Okay. Well, same as. Okay. Auto books about Pokemon research. Bill's Diary. Ninth, February 19th, 2000. Damn, that's like a whole month before we came here. Okay. Today I modified the Pokemon storage system. It's now possible to name the boxes. I'm going to add some more features soon. A lot of trainers asked me to enhance the capacity of the storage, so I did. There are 14 boxes available now. There's another feature I'm working on. A feature where you can see the Pokemon on the display. There's still more or less in beta. And I'm confident we'll be finished soon. Okay. What yeah, because Bill created the uh, Pokemon storage system in the PCs. What if this has to do with the storage system? Oh, the infection? <coughs> mm -hmm. Maybe. February I mean, 28th. A, a few d days ago, I've seen some guys in dark clothes. I think they were from Team Rocket. Some of them were standing in front of the radio tower. What are they up to? Nothing good, I think. The organization causes problems wherever they appear. Like they did with Carillion City and Saffron City. Hope the police are going to do something against them. Don't Carillion. worry, don't worry about it. I always made attention. <laughs> Shush. I'm too invested in the Lord. Don't worry. Shh. <laughs> Did you just fucking no. let me? Oh, love you too. 
Fucking dork. Nerd. You're a dork. You're Gun a dork. You're my dork. <laughs> Freaking nerd. True. Goldenrod is such a peaceful city. <clears throat> March. Oh, oh, okay. Here we go. So it's March. like a month each, or like a couple, like two yeah. weeks each time he writes in it? I guess. So Dear Diary, it? there was nothing interesting in the past time. That's why I didn't write anything particular, but this changed now. Most of Team Rocket bailed, but I think Team Rocket isn't the main problem anymore. Lately, there are these strange murders. People are going insane. There are reports about some folks that are eating people. That's sick, isn't it? The police are examining those causes. I hope the situation won't last long. March 19th, 2000. A day later. <clears throat> so, I really don't know what to write. Never seen something like that. It's now known why some people are insane and eating human flesh. Those crazy people aren't alive anymore, but they're somehow dead people and Pokemon just turning into something undead. I don't know. What the hell is that? The city's falling apart and the police are doing nothing anymore. Is Goldenrod City doomed? Yeah. Oh dear. Another day afterwards? I don't leave this house anymore. I'm too scared. They're everywhere. Just everywhere. The infection, whatever it is. You're gonna get infected when you get bitten. The living people here do know that. I think the police knew, but they didn't want to tell us. I don't really know what's the cause for this disease. Where did I guess you were wrong. It's not the Pokemon thing. <clears throat> yeah. Here, outside. Only I know is the, the infection spreading out very fast. All of Johto is doomed if we're not doing anything about the matter. <clears throat> March 22nd. I've seen something strange recently. When I was looking out the window, I saw that police officer running out of the game corner. He locked the oh, door from uh, the game corner. What's his face? Claws. I was laughing hysterically. That was so creepy. I was curious about that, that's why I sneaked out of my house. When I came closer to the door, I heard the screams. But I couldn't open the door because this guy took the key. The city is lost, there's no hope left. We're all losing our humanity and our conscience. It seems like Bill was in a hurry, and we wrote the following things. I have to make the decision, I have to lead Goldenrod. I've been waiting for the military to help the days, but no one came. I have to take my chances now. I took my Pidgey out from my internal storage system. I'm flying back to my lighthouse on Route 24 near this ruling city. I'll be okay. safe there. Maybe Kanto isn't infected yet, who knows. Mom, Dad, I hope you're fine. I wanted to see you for the last time, and I'm so sorry, Bill. Well, at least well, Bill might be alive, hopefully. Um, are we not going to mention the fact that the officer that is currently in our base right now was seen laughing hysterically after he locked the doors yeah, behind no, everyone? Yeah, that's... Mm. And then when he was in the thing, he was like acting like, oh, I'm so... That's weird. That is really weird. <laughs> I, I'm, I'm, I'm. I knew it. <laughs> Something's wrong. Oh god. Cla <clears throat> oh. Did he? Did he shoot? What happened here? Oh god. Wait, did he kill himself? I think he did. Claus. He. <clears throat> <laughs> Was it out of guilt? <clears throat> I think Maybe was, he was yeah. laughing hysterically because he just went fucking mental. And he yeah. was so- he was like- uh, Mickey, why did you jinx it? Oh god. <laughs> god. He suddenly took out his pistol and shot himself in the head. We couldn't stop him. Do you think he had a reason for doing this? Did he mention something to you, Ethan? Oh god. He... He did mention something. He said that he was responsible for the death of a couple people. And maybe guilt made him kill himself. I think that could be possible. Seems like he kept his last bullet for himself. I fuck! I knew it! Yeah. <laughs> you called it. Damn! <laughs> you fucking got The Vic sticks it back at it again. Man. <laughs> it the Vic stinks. <laughs> yes, I call it Mick stinks. Okay, shut up. God. <laughs> he couldn't have done this. Instinct? Mick stink? Gotcha. <laughs> he had to, okay? You should get he one of the courts to. as soon as possible. Albert, could you help me? Oh, because he might change. Oh, he might change. Martha, could you clean the floor, please? Yes, of course. Ethan, come to me once we get rid of the corpse. All right. Oh, boy. Oh, jeez. Well, keep... That's one uh, less. Save that last joy thing, because I don't know... Yeah, no, we're not gonna do that. My voice cracked so hard, damn. I know, right? Jeez. Yeah, we're staying with the new outfit, okay? Yeah. <clears throat> I can see it. Wait, did we even get another thing after the modern one? No, we didn't. Nope, that's all the outfits unlocked, actually. Oh. Yep. Oh, it is. Okay. Oh, no. Oh. How are you? Okay, you she was looking at the wall. Oh, okay. Anything new for me? Okay, no. No, same. 
I think, yeah, I think this is Dave. <clears throat> that thing with Claus came out of nowhere. If he had just talked to us about his problems, I'm sure it would have been a different solution. A huge loss for all of us. How are you doing? Did you find supplies? Oh, oh yeah! I found a lot! The entire- every floor's worth. Yep. Perfect. This will keep us alive for a long time. I'm so relieved now. Although we can't flee from Goldenrod City. Hey, Ethan. You look very tired. Do you want to take a nap? At least for a couple hours? You seem so stressed out. Yes. I'm really tired. Some sleep sounds like a great idea. You're welcome. Just lay in your bed. I mean, we haven't stopped going... Since. Yeah, actually, though, we have not. It's been like, what, three days? <laughs> ah! oh, fucking <laughs> motherfucker. <laughs> Scared the shit out of me. What the fuck? Fuck you, gay. <laughs> that scared the fuck ass out of me. Fucking. <laughs> so mad. <laughs> fucking. Really? Really? <laughs> really, gay? <laughs> fucking piece of shit. <laughs> you fucking asshole. <laughs> Oh man! I can only I'm clap. So I can only clap because the whole got <laughs> they, so they did the whole game without a jump scare and they saved it just <laughs> to scare so us. So fucking rude for like zero fucking reason. What the hell? God, shit Good out. use. Good use, you son of a bitch. <laughs> right? Fuck you. Can't sleep. These horrible images in my head. Don't god. do it again. Okay. I swear to God. Okay. That would that, dude. <laughs> <laughs> right? Oh. They used it perfectly. That's the worst part. Right? <laughs> Fucking d assholes. I thought so we bad. were getting attacked. Me too. Like, Jesus. I thought like Dave turned or something. And he just like ah. God. Like, right. I thought, I thought God. we got the bad ending right there too. Right? <laughs> Shit. Okay. Oh, Ethan, you're awake already. <gasps> yeah. Uh, yeah. I had a bad dream, but I think that's to be expected given the situation. For how long did I sleep? <coughs> For about two hours. Oh. At least I got a bit of sleep. <laughs> I'm sorry. <laughs> well, if I'm already awake, I could get out of bed as well. I think I could still do it. That's a new face. Yeah. <laughs> what? Uh, sorry. You're new here. Applause. You can see. Something else? Uh. Mm -hmm. Sorry, I'm, I'm in a bad mood. Whatever. When you're here already, I'm Walter. Walter Hoffman. Anything else? Ah, yes. I'm not allowed to get angry. I have some heart problems. You think I'm old, hmm? <clears throat> I'm just 54. That has nothing to do with Wait. my age. His last name starts with an H, right? And he has heart problems. Remember that the fucking radio thing? About a, the dude that murdered his entire family and then... Oh boy. Oh. <laughs> I, I already don't trust this dude. I just remembered the radio thing about the guy that... I've just, I'm just oh, gone God. totally silent because I'm just like... Fuck! Fuck! <laughs> His last name starts with an H. It's something about the fam the family with an H. Oh shit! <laughs> oh god! Oh, I swear oh, to God! Fuck. I swear My to God, Walter, you motherfucker! Empty. I do not trust you one bit. Maybe you could help me <laughs> in the future. I don't trust him either. I swear to God! I swear to God! If we get the bad ending, he just fucking. Oh god! Oh god! Oh god! I swear to God, game! I swear to God, you better not pull this shit on me. Check this out. Fa save number 10? That's our backup save for here. Okay. Hey, my friend. You're already awake again. Wait, you couldn't sleep, huh? At least not as good as I'd hoped for. The situation's costing all of us our sleep. Well, what happened in the meantime? Well, a lot. A new survivor <clears throat> killer got here. Yep. You mean Walter? I've already talked to him. He's a big asshole. Yeah, you that's ask an me. understatement. That is an understatement. I <laughs> swear. <laughs> yeah, pretty much. <laughs> Even he agrees. Ah, uh, whatever. You should hear what I just found out. While you were sleeping, I was outside and passed by the flower shop, and it seems like there's Ooh. another survivor inside. 
think it was a woman. The voice I heard of crying definitely was feminine. It'd be great if someone could get her out of there. Had no time to find out more. Fog was too heavy and I sensed infection approaching me. Fog? Ethan, could you? We need to help the remaining people in Goldenrod. Why is it foggy in Goldenrod of City all of a sudden? The flower shop, you said? Where exactly can I find it? It's in the northeastern part of the city next to the gym. You should have no problems finding it, but I can't give you a key or anything. Knock the door and see if you can get some response. Okay, I'll try that. Shouldn't take too long. <clears throat> no, ow! Oh shit. Oh no, it's still in this area, it's fine. Yeah. <clears throat> okay. I am scared. Oh. Why is it foggy and golden right now? Why did it move? Wait, the Why music did the change? fog move? No, wait, it's the same music as before. Okay. No, it's still the same, yeah. Okay. More! I mean, that's what we expected eventually. Oh my god! Yeah. Was it Harold? I don't think it was, no. Okay. Um, the sprite was very similar to Harold, and it made me sad for like a split second. Oh god. Oh god. Stop! Oh god. Asshole! Oh, we're losing. Wait, talk to Nurse Joy, because he got more supplies. Maybe she got more healing things? I think it's <laughs> only meant for food, though. Oh. Uh, hello? Uh, Is somebody in there? Uh, who was there? <clears throat> my name's Ethan. I'm a Pokemon trainer. And I want to help you. I've been told that someone's in here who could need my help. Can you open the door? I don't know. I don't want to take any risks. You can understand me, right? Listen, I'm not bitten. And I don't want to harm you either. I'm just another survivor, like you. I'm coming from the underground bunker below Goldenrod, and I was ta tasked with looking for you. We provide protection and food. It's safe there. Let me help you. It's not safe here. Trust me. We have a lot of good people who can take care of you. And you are really speaking the truth, young man? I promise. I have no reason for lying to you. If you open the door, we can get out of here immediately. The bunker isn't far away. Okay. I'll open the door. Y you can come in now. Jump scare. Right. Oh. oh. Thank you for letting me in. It's dangerous outside. Even if you have a Pokemon. <laughs> I know about the outside. Sometimes I take a look outside the window and see these changed humans and Pokemon. Even friends who came to the flower shop regularly to buy some things, even they have changed. Is... is that...? Top right. Yeah, the old man? No, I yeah. think that's Dave in a worse state than before. <clears throat> Maybe. Oh, you mean Howard? Or Howard, I yeah. Why he messing up the, the Howard? Because <laughs> he's missing <laughs> hair now, right? Yeah. <clears throat> yeah, before he had a full head, head of hair. <laughs> Maybe it is him. I don't know. Go ahead. I hope not. They are wandering the streets with an empty, empty glance. They are unrecognizable. Those aren't the people you used to know. Sorry. I was so impolite. My name is Susan. <clears throat> I am the owner of the flower shop. And you are... Ethan? Right? That's correct! Why do you know our name? What did you say about this underground bunker? Is it truly <clears throat> be a safe place? Who's there? I... I just have to get out of here. Yeah, we're somewhat of a uh, we're somewhat of a bigger group down there. I'm sure you'll know of them. Our leader Dave has an eye on everything on he checks. Every on every yeah! Our leader Dave has an eye on everything he checks. Uh, for what's happening in the city regularly. Or Martha, she ran the daycare. She takes care of those who got treated by Nurse Joy. Everyone's got a specific task. Maybe you can grow some vegetables or something like that. Who is the guy behind you? <clears throat> that. Oh. That was my husband. Oh. <laughs> what? What happened to him? <laughs> oh. Oh no, he left us not that long ago. Is this the reason Dave heard her cry? Oh no. Uh, I'm sorry for you, Susan. How did this happen? He was sick. A sickness that's deadly but can't be healed. <laughs> he should have been admitted oh. to the hospital, but... That's oh, no. even sadder! <laughs> then this outbreak happened, and nobody could care for him anymore. He locked, we locked us in here days ago. He had enough supplies, but his condition worsened. <laughs> Look at her before. picture! <laughs> oh. 
And a couple hours ago. Oh! I am so sorry. That's why I have to get out of here as soon as possible. I see. Get my turn. And then we can go. Oh boy. <laughs> Speaking of. Susan? Susan? Get behind us. Oh fuck. Uh, Susan, it's oh, time to go. Frank? Y you are alive? No, he's not. Susan, get behind us. Susan, be S careful! Oh no. No! I and I thought I had lost you forever, darling. You said you weren't feeling so good. And... And... Then you closed your eyes. I tried feeling your heartbeat, but there was none. You weren't breathing either. <laughs> Susan, don't! <coughs> oh god. Motherfucker. God damn it. We can't get out! We can't get out! Wait, really? Oh shit. Oh fuck. Motherfucker. In such a closed space, we have to go through all that dialogue again. Ah. God damn it. Don't use the nurse joy thing. We can do this. We can, yeah, we can this, do this. You know this. what? We're gonna pause the recording so we don't, you guys don't have to sit through all that again. Uh, <laughs> God. Also, three to one. I'm guessing you unpaused it or yeah. Oh shit. Come on, come on, come on, come on, come on, Mickey. Come on, Mickey, get this. Oh my god! Please, come on! Oh my yes. god! Holy shit! <sighs> Fuck! I couldn't protect her. This. This was preventable. She didn't have to die. Fucking shit! Oh, he's crying. Look at him. Oh, no! It's not your fault, man. I. I. I'm so sorry. Okay, now All right, I'll leave you. Go ahead. <laughs> okay, successful battle. Why yep. do I have the feeling when we're gonna leave? Okay, now we just leave her there. So Ethan is just crushed by this because of how preventable it was. Yeah, no. shit. Okay, okay, okay. You know what we careful. need to do? Use that lap final. We're dead. <laughs> we're dead. We're oh, like shit. so dead. Oh, that's what we need to do. Okay. Apparently so. Okay, here's what I want to do, though, for real. <laughs> I want to... I love that. <laughs> that was kind of funny. <laughs> we need... There's something we very important we need to do five seconds later. It just dies. Like, aha! We need to take care of these fellas. Oh, God. Oh, God. Do you have, like, one HP left? Fuck. <laughs> I really don't want to use Nurse Joy. I just want to clear everybody out here. I know, right? If I clear everybody out here, right? Okay, maybe if we go lower down. I don't know. I like how the music changes every time. Hey. Cool. What I could do. Okay, that's one down. Yep. Let's check down here if there's anything. Okay, good. So long as we're down here, we have the advantage. Mm-hmm. We got this. Yeah, here's my open world, open, open, whatever you got, then up there. Yeah. Yeah, I see that. Look at that, perfect. Mm -hmm. That helps. That yep. really, really helps. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Two more, I think? There's... Yeah. Or one more. I'm unsure how much health we have left. I was about to ask. Eh, how are all these guys getting here? Like, duh, the fucking, the fucking race thing, the the train tracks. Just starting to appear more general at this point. 
Yeah. 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 Okay, so everybody's gonna say the same thing. Yeah. <clears throat> Just trash. I, I do not trust that William dude whatsoever. Egg is doing great. You hear Wait, what? You can hear it making sounds. It's my heart's very Oh shit. Let's go. Okay. What happened? Didn't she want to open the door? Uh. No. I was inside. You heard the shop's owner. But. Suddenly, her seemingly dead husband jumped up and tore her to pieces. What? Fuck! Fuck! How? She had her infected husband in there? But, do you see? That's the exact reason we can't allow infected people to stay here. That's just way too dangerous. Dangerous for everybody! Yes. But... I don't think she knew about it. She didn't notice her husband getting bitten. I, I can't think of another explanation. I see. Her death is very sad, nonetheless. I knew the lady. Not a lot, but I've seen her a couple of times. Every time she opened the door at her shop in the morning. Mm. I was almost certain she was the one locked in there. So her husband died in front of her eyes. Oh my. That shouldn't hit me this much. Ethan, I, um... <clears throat> I need to ask you for something. Some private matter this time. Come to me again uh -huh. if you have a moment. Please. Hey, kiddo. My medicines are empty at an alarming rate. And I really don't want to think about what happens when they're empty. So the medicine's vital for you? No. Of course not. Chronic heart problems are never a danger. How could you think that? <laughs> what a question. My god. I'm Everything with this heart is okay, vital, okay? okay? Know. Foolish kid. <laughs> I'm I, you know what? Well, same. Same. Same, Ethan. Same. <laughs> <laughs> like, Ethan's literally a 10 year old kid. How would he know what that freaking asshole? Listen, the medicine's really important for me. I still have a couple of pills, but they'll give soup with a couple of days. And what happens when it's good, I'm, I'm as good as dead, understand? I'll get them. No. <laughs> yeah. I see. I'll try to get the new pills. Great. I still don't trust you. used to get my medicine from the Pokemon Center. You can find the heart oh, pills shit. there. Talk to Nurse Joy. She has the key for the Pokemon Center and she'll give it to no. you. Maybe we can use oh, the, and... the machine there. Maybe. Please. By the way, kiddo. Thanks. I still don't trust him. <sighs> Hello, Ethan. I talked to Walter about his heart disease. I always gave him his pills. But he didn't come anymore after a while. I guess he got his medicine somewhere else. Here, I have a center key. Please let us use the, the machine. Please, for the love of God. <laughs> his pills are, st are stored. So, okay. You'll have to search for them. Good luck, and be careful. Okay, so our first place of interest was the Pokemon Center from all the way back. Yep. Now we have to get in. Yep. Oh boy, anything new with you? Nope. What about you? I just realized we're like very close to opening almost every single door. I think there's like one house left we still haven't unlocked yet. <laughs> yeah. This is why I dealt with all those zombies, by the way. Just um, yeah. just so we have, don't get ambushed <laughs> while we're... Uh, why the Pokemon like Center? Again? That would be unfortunate. Now, I know oh, we're at low God. health. We're actually at only three health, but I'm not jumping the gun yet. Nope. I won't need this anymore. Oh, fuck. Come here. Oh, shit. Don't turn around. No. No. Oh, God. That's okay. We're open. It's an open, it's an open area. We got this. Hmm? Ah! God, fuck, Stop. fuck. Hmm? Stay me! Alright. Go! Oh. oh, thank God. The PC's turned off, but it probably wouldn't work anyways. Oh! Oh, have another Pokemon. Oh, shit. Fuck! Imagine! If the storage system was working, I could get my spinner rack from the box. God! Man! Oh, we can't use oh, the center. Oh, fuck. We... We could save. 
<gasps> we can save in here. Yes. Okay. Gotta be upstairs. Yep. Here we go. Seems like we have to search for the medicine. Is that a fucking Clefairy? It used to be one. It's a chance, actually. Oh. Completely empty. Wait. There's something. Oh. oh thank you. <laughs> <laughs> Nothing. All boxes are empty. Use Pacey's that potion. turned off. Wait, I want to see if there's more. Doesn't make sense to enter the trade room. Well, how what do the... you know? Maybe we could trade for a for, for fucking strong for Pokemon, you asshole. Trade to <laughs> ourselves. There we go. That's the versus room. Yeah. It won't Fine. open. I always wondered what use this machine has. Oh, Doctor's shit. report from March 19th, 2000. Lore? Yes! These riots in the city may cause a lot of victims. Even the police remain silent. There's something wrong in the city. We had a new patient today. His body was totally bitten. We couldn't hi hold him stable. He died. But this wasn't caused by injuries. No. The problem was the incredible fever he had. His body was heating, but in the end, the body gave up. And the, exi and the exodus happened in his bed. He was dead, no doubt. A short time after, I brought his body into the morgue. Just wanted to know what actually caused this high fever. Made tests, but I couldn't find anything out. After some unsuccessful hours, I wanted to abduct the head the dead patient. There had to be something in his body, so I did the wide cut on his thorax. While I was cutting his chest open, the patient woke up and attacked me. Oh, totally shit. insane and didn't let me go. I knew he'd kill me if I wouldn't do something about it. I took the knife and rammed it into his right eye. He died again. I took his corpse and put it back on the autopsy table. This time I tied him. And nothing changed. He's still dead. I didn't t tell the incident to anyone. I have to know what's going on here. Well, that bite wound I got from... <sighs> Oh, God. I feel so numb. I don't feel that good. Got some headache. My body temperature seems higher than normal. So I think I found out about the strange character this case is Dr. Theodore Moss. Supplement. Oh, medicine. <coughs> Dr. Oh. Theodore Moss was bitten by an infected. And I've seen his womb and alarmed the rest of us. Dr. Moss will get in the quarantine. Can't take the risk of someone with this got infected. Everyone who gets into the close contact with the infected has to get in the quarantine or kill. It's the only way. Nurse Joy. Oh, shit. Huh. So where the fuck mm, is the heart? Boy. Honestly, the potion was the heart thing. That's no, really there's really more funny. here. Oh, there. Okay. There it is. <laughs> oh, jeez. Now let's go back. Nothing left. Some pa p patches, headache pills. No. Liquid potion? medicine. Won't have a use for us. Liquid How medicine. How do you know? <laughs> Take it anyways. Okay, whatever. Fuck it. Okay. Man. That might be Dr. Moss. Yeah. <laughs> you know, you see, the real sad thing is the fact that, um, every Pokemon's basically stuck in limbo now. That's in the PCs. If the power's, like, oh, yeah, totally yep. fucked. Yep. So, uh, <laughs> you know. Oh, I mean, boy. Hopefully they're doing much better than everyone is out here. <laughs> Shit. Again, I still don't trust this motherfucker. <clears throat> Do you have them? You took your time, kiddo. <clears throat> it's getting my nerves, old man. I thought I'd have to get the bucket. Give them to me. That should be enough for a while. Guess I have to thank you now. Stabs us in our face. Hey, what's that? There was a TM from another region between the heart Oh, pills. shit. Here. Give that to your creature. You call Pokemon. <clears throat> what the hell is this TM? Forgot Scratch. Oh. Uh, okay. And. Ooh! Oh, even stronger version. Oh hell yeah. Well, creature can now use Slash. Can deal double damage. Oh shit. Whatever. That's everything I have for you. Now get out of my sight. Well, fuck you too. I need dude. some rest. Grateful bastard. We got, we got a new move! Yay! <clears throat> hey, um, there's something I want to tell you. When I passed by the flower shop, I was actually going home. But uh, I didn't get there because I had someone heard, heard someone crying in the flower shop. Well, I wanted to go there because I was going to get something important. Something important for me, and I need it back. I'm constantly thinking about it. Ethan, I know this won't benefit our group at all, but I have to ask you something for personal reasons. Uh, okay, I'm listening. 
There's an old souvenir lying in my kitchen that I need back. Souvenir? And what? it's really important for you. I mean, I'm risking my life out there. But all of that's just for a souvenir? Dave, clear your mind. <coughs> yeah, you're right. I'm sorry. I don't know what I thought there. <sighs> you know what? Fuck it. If your mood is down on the ground, you won't be helping us much either. I'll do it. Huh. Well, you got a lot braver. You're sure you want to do this? Yes. Your house isn't far away anyways. Shouldn't be that big of a hassle. Okay. Wow, Ethan. Thanks. Oh, you won, my friend. I keep slipping out of the accent. You're cute. It's okay. <laughs> it's all right. Okay. Just go into my kitchen. The souvenir is lying on the table in the corner. Thought about this for the last couple of hours. Here's my house's key. And thanks. Thank you. Speaking of, so remember when I said that hey, there's still one more house yet we haven't unlocked yet. Yeah. <laughs> I think the yeah, I think we are nearing end game. <coughs> oh boy. You, you're not gonna use the potion? Not yet. Not unless I like have a need to. You, you're I'm, I'm one HP, violently so trying to use as little as I can. Oh, there's two doors. There's still two houses unlocked yet. Huh. Never mind. You see? Whoa, do you hear the music? Yeah, I don't like it. Radio broadcasting. Why are we playing as Quay Lava? Wait, what? Yeah. That should be it. It's a photo. Let's see what's on it. Oh. Is that Erica from fucking Ca the Canter region? <coughs> I think so. It shows Dave at the beach together with a girl. Or maybe not. There's something written on the back of it. Beach trip to San Wood, Wood City. <laughs> For the best girl in the world. Love you so much, honey. I'm forever happy that I found you. Soon we'll move to Goldenrod City together. I'm looking forward to this. In your love, yours, Dave. Oh. What's the fucking music? Oh, Dave. Now I know why you wanted to get that photo back so much. Let's get out of here, Brando. I think it's time we left up Dave's mood a bit. Oh, God. Why do I have a feeling I know who it is? I know it! Oh, God, it's <laughs> Howard. Oh, no. It's Howard. Oh. Oh, Jesus. Are you okay, dude? Oh, dear. Oh, Harold. Never mind, not Howard. I'm fucking smart. Oh no! Oh. Damn it! Oh yeah, we're definitely gonna have to heal for this. Ooh! I was gonna use the potion. You don't listen to me. Well, I didn't expect <laughs> Harold to bust in the room. <laughs> you should always expect there's something to bust in the room, you freaking nerd. No! You know, no! You stinky. <laughs> That's no. why you listen to me. No! Yep, you stink. No, you stink. no, we're not no, no, we, we don't listen. Nah, 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 listening? Nah. <laughs> <laughs> What God. the fuck? <laughs> Loving the mess with you. It's funny. Me too. Okay, uh, so now we have a problem. Save before you get that potion. Yep. Wait, trash. I always suck the trash. In the fridge. In the fridge. Bottle of water. Bottle. Bo no. No. Save. Okay. <clears throat> That's sad. That is really sad. That is really fucking sad. Also, that the David looks so weird without his right? sunglasses. <laughs> I'm saying so. I'm just I'm seeing, seeing his fright with the sunglasses. <laughs> now it just looks weird without it. <laughs> you ask him about the sunglasses when they're off one day, and he just he goes, "I wear them when I'm scared." But you're always oh. wearing. And then <laughs> and then the realization hits. Or even worse, he started. I don't know. I think I worded that wrong. We try that again. Like, because he's wear always wearing the sunglasses. And then one day you see him without them, you're like, Hey, Dave, why do you have your sunglasses off? Oh, I wear them when I'm scared, but you're always wearing. And then oh, no. <laughs> I took that from a sketch, by the way. You all, I think everybody knows what sketch that's from. Yeah. You're cute, it's okay. <clears throat> oh, boy. Damn, Harold! <laughs> Holy 
Holy fucking shit, that's a lot of damage! That was... Harold! Oh, oh my god. He... Quick, let's grab the photo and get out of here. I felt wrong. <laughs> that really did. <laughs> like happy ass Pokemon music after you God. like. Man. Oh. Uh, okay. uh, oh fuck. No. No. Hey. What? You again? Are you trying to fight us again? Calm down. I never wanted to prevent you from surviving. Tell me, what's your name? I think you might have to speak up a little bit. The game might be loud. Okay. Tell me, what is your name? Uh, name? Uh, I'm Ethan. Okay, Ethan. I'm sorry that I've threatened you and your friend. Wait, hold on. Don't worry about it. Hold on. It is like so loud, this part of the music. I think like 4... 50? There. Okay. And I deserve, and I just, and that I destroyed the electricity of the train, but I have my reasons. And what reason? Just imagine this. That high-speed train is loud as hell. And it has a bright lighting. You can even see the lights from a great distance. And when the undead see that lighting from the outside, then all hope is lost. If even more infected come to the Goldenrod City, we are all doomed. People who are still alive could leave Goldenrod City with us. What's the problem? We're leaving this place, then, forever. Well, I mean, what if they will just have to follow the train's lights. Unless yeah. you destroy the lighting, but... Ethan, you don't understand. It's not about the few survivors in the Goldenrod City. It's about mankind. This pest actually started... Whoa, whoa, Wait, what? What? <laughs> what? Yeah, no, I didn't even have to reread re that. I mean, Ethan got the same <laughs> thought. This disaster started here and spread out? Exactly. But... But how? That means if it started here... So we can stop this plague? One thing I can tell you surely. You can't cure this infection. But yes, we <laughs> could stop it. So no more people and Pokemon get infected. This has the highest priority. Do you understand now? That's why we have to protect Goldenrod City. I got it. We can end this here. But how? The how is a good question. Ethan, I'll come back later to you. What the fuck? Firstly, I have to take care of my injured mill tank. You still haven't? It's been like an entire ass day, what the hell? I'm, I'm sorry, sorry about your mill tank. It's alright. I was the one who challenged you. If we are going to survive this and the world is back to normal, I will give you the plane badge. Oh shit! Our third gym badge. But, but, One question. Uh -huh. You group up with the people from the underground? Yes. Why? I will give you one advice. Wash yourself. People are sometimes wearing that mask <laughs> to pretend something. The, the fucking serial murder? <laughs> serial killer down there? Sometimes people might have a dirty secret. So, see ya, Ethan. She knows. She knows about William. Well, thanks for clearing it for it's flying about it, at least. We already kind of knew that. He was kind you, of sus, but right? thanks. You found him? <laughs> yes, here it is. Wow. Thanks, Ethan. That means the world to me. <sighs> we have to keep going. We will get through this shit. We came so far, everything will turn out fine. I am absolutely sure. Since you mentioned all this shit, I just met Whitney. Whitney? The gym leader who attacked you in Herald? Yes. But it doesn't matter that she attacked us for now. I talked to her for a bit, and she seemed to know much more about the outbreak about th than what we do. She said the source of this infection is here in the city. What? Here? In the city? And how? Where exactly is the source? Did she tell you that? Unfortunately not. What if it's the gravestone under the subway? Oh, fuck. Why, I didn't even think of that. Unfortunately not. She didn't get that far. She left. Before what if she that is me the... everything. Oh, <clears throat> boy. Wow. The root of all evil lies here. I never thought of that. 
And you think we could stop this infection? Maybe. Yeah? That would be a glimpse of hope in this godforsaken world. Thanks again for that image, Ethan. You're welcome. There's another important thing. I saw something outside. Come back to me when you have time for it. Oh, oh. shit. <gasps> oh my god, what is it gonna be? Right? I am so curious. Oh my god, a little baby. Oh, it's a baby. Aw. Holy shit. Aww. It's a little baby. Wow, I I've never seen a Pokemon egg hatch before. Oh, look at this. A cute little Charmander <laughs> hatched. It's so cute. There. Charmander. I, well, those, I've heard those are strong fire type Pokemon, like you, Brando. And it turns into a flying type when it evolves. Lava, yep. lava, good lava. <laughs> Oh, I'll take good care of it. We're gonna have a flying type. It's gonna be a fucking awesome ass Char Charizard. <laughs> Charmander! Ch that little Charmander's so cute. <laughs> oh, it's adorable. Charmander's such a cute small baby. That's what this hopeless world needs right now. Hope for a new life. Okay. You know what? Just to be safe, because I don't trust my computer to not crash. <laughs> we're gonna end it here. Just this episode here. Okay. But we're gonna probably be able to finish it after this one anyway so thank you everybody for watching take, take care. care have a good one have a good one bye, bye. that's a three and a half hour long episode holy, holy shit wait really yep